our adventure. So yeah, so we're back in the dreamscape. We've just uh, entered. Uh, back in the straight face gate, definitely feels like a dream. I'm not cold at all, and everything sort of worked. Strange girl must have lived in that house. Is she gonna pop up and ask me to save up Ryan again? I need to find out what she wants from me. She's the clue to all this. So yeah, the Mr. Y, we think it's Mr. Y, he was a big fat like that weird kind of dude. So we think it was kinda she's afraid of this girl. Dehydrate from the so this is Zoe. I want to stay far away from those cracks. I want to stay far stay away. away from those cracks. <laughs> sure, everyone likes a crack. <laughs> right, so carry on. Yep, there she is. She's not as creepy as she was when she first started. I found her. I found April Ryan, but you must save her. I don't know. Who are you? What are you? What are you? Save her, Zoe. Please. At least she's been nicer now. She's mm. fine. She doesn't need to be saved. Find April Ryan. Save her. And that's when she's like, oh no, not this again. Uh Boom. Ah! In the hole. Once again? Convergence. So now we're Kivon. Kivon is the prince. Of, well, whatever I know, he's like a noble guy for these. You know, Prot of kind of. Oh crap. Horrible angle. Come on then. Come here, you. Come on. <laughs> no way. I killed your friend, so. Can he not? Come on. Basic combat. Say, like, come on! Come on. Wow! You're definitely dead. So, I'm just like, come here, scary cat. Please, no, don't hurt me. Please. Please. Answer my questions, and I might spare your life. That was I a very. I'll tell you anything you want. Just don't hurt me. <laughs> Even there, you get my toothpick. Uh, question about the rebels. Everything you know about the rebels. I'm just an honest businessman. I don't know anything about... Your life is hanging by a very thin thread. All right, all right. So I've uh, had some dealings with certain people, but it's just business. Herbs, roots, potions, medicines, that's all. That's what we're for then. Do you know how to get in touch with these customers of yours? If I tell you, they'll have me killed for sure. These are not the kind of people you mess around with. You don't want to mess around with me? Right. If you refuse to cooperate, I'll string you up and put a knife to your belly until either you spill your guts or your guts spill to the ground. Oh, Look, man, Kevin. I have no quarrel with you or your people. I'll tell you anything you want. Anything at all. 
Fuck out. Apostle, there's a message for you. What? They've caught a rebel witch. She was using magic and she resisted arrest. Oh, I'm not you. In Friar's Keep. Where is that? On the east side of the city. I can escort you, Apostle. No, I will find it. I should go immediately. Maybe this witch has had dealings with the Scorpion. Yeah, Take so... Care of this one, soldier. He has valuable information that he's very generously agreed to share with us. Bring he's it like, to the tower and wait for me. Sir. Oh, dear. So... This... Oh, move out of the way then. He fought yeah. bravely, but in the end he was no match for my sword. The god no life is taken idly, but I am only doing what the goddess has asked me to do. Oh, goddesses. Right, what about this book, man? Is he gonna be like, ahem? I can show you my book if you like, sir. It's not been banned. It's not been banned? Well, that's when he's got like a porn mag or something hiding it. Oh, no, no. Oh, wait, Arcadia doesn't have that. <laughs> so, I'm guessing we go this way. And now we're in Old Town. <laughs> Time accessories, eh? <laughs> Everything any discerning seafarer. Sir. Oh, so they don't—they don't like Just him at all. Be. We haven't done you or your people any harm. You'd all rather wish we'd just disappear, wouldn't you? Hey, aren't you the guy we just arrested? In here alone. Watch it, boy. Boy. I can't believe you're still being held up. The supplies should have left the city two days ago, and you with them. Without proper authorization, there is no way for our vessel to leave harbor. If we do anything to awake suspicion... Yeah. I know, Chuan. It's just frustrating. The plan was for you to be halfway up the river already. We leave this afternoon. Everything is in order now. The soldiers will not delay us any further. I hope you're right. Everyone's waiting for the medicines and the... <laughs> April! April, got to. That girl, Zoe, I saw her. She's been taken by the Azadi. Oh, what? whoops. Where? To that place you told me about. Friar's Keep. Oh, Friar! Did the Azadi torture rebels? Why did they bring her there? Do you think she's going to tell on us? I don't think so. What would she tell them? She doesn't know anything about us. Yeah. We need to help her. She has no one else. I know, I know. You don't have to tell me. You two get ready to leave. You can't delay the boat any longer. No. What? Oh, you must be joking. He's got a crush on April, this guy. Go on a mission again. Brim. You Brim. already have a mission, Bryn. A very important one. If you don't bring the supplies back to the swamp, people will die. I'll see you at home, guys. Safe journey, and guard those supplies well. When are we gonna do something like this? Yeah. Because she has much on her mind. I know, but she's always had a lot on her mind, and she hasn't been this way before. There's something going on that she's not telling us. I'm sure of it. <laughs> it is no business of ours, and she is right. We already have a mission. Come, we need to go to the harbor. The paperwork may have been cleared by now, and we must not delay the boat any further. Nope. The poor Zoe's been thrown as soon as she got back. Oh. Oh, God. I remember this vehicle, this guy. <clears throat> Just snooty mm, guy. One moment. One moment. To... Mm -hmm. Please, a moment. Gods <laughs> again. COVID, <laughs> maybe? <laughs> Dust here isn't any good for my life. Oh, I see. Yes, may I help you? I represent the tower. I am told you have a prisoner. But we don't use that word here. Yes. They are our guests until your people come to uh, pick them up. Very demonic, isn't he? <laughs> I wish to speak with this prisoner. Hmm, so I see. Uh, am I to understand that you have all the paperwork in order? The emissary insists that I should speak with your prisoner now. Mm. Yeah. I, I will never understand this blatant disregard of the proper bureaucratic process, but uh, as you wish. God, if you please. Yes. Sturdy. Mm. Delicious. Mm. 
There she is. All oh, right, okay. Yeah. <laughs> what was that for, eh? Be alone with her. I, I beg your pardon. No, no. I beg your pardon. Things are done here. Local laws apply, and they are abundantly clear. During interrogations, an independent body must be present to ensure the legality of said process. The process. And I am that independent body. Not independent enough. Of this. Yeah, I'm sure it will. Carry on. I represent the tower. Who? The tower. The supreme authority of the Azadi Ooh. Empire in the Northlands. I am Apostle Alvani, personal envoy of the Six. I don't know what any of that is. I don't know anything. I haven't done anything. She keeps saying that. She's a bit whiny, this one. Do not <laughs> interrupt, please. Hmm. You stand accused of being a spy. You uh -huh. will be transported to Sadir, our capital, at our earliest convenience where you will be tried as a spy. I'm not a spy. Then what are you? A witch? You were spotted practicing magic. I wasn't practicing anything. I just... Just landed in a very inconvenient spot. Three right. soldiers saw you materialize out of thin air in the middle of the marketplace. If you're not a witch, then how did you do that? Someone else sent me here to Arc. I mean, to Mercuria. Okay. I'm from the, the south. I'm not a spy, and I'm not a witch. I see. I believe. Is he gonna believe me? Yeah, he believes. Speak hey. with Warden, and maybe he will let you go. That is all I can do. You're just going to leave me here. This is not my jurisdiction. I'm sorry. At least he believes me, and he's not. It, he believes Zoe, so that's something. I take it she'll be uh, loaded onto the next airship bound for Sadir, yes? I no. don't think she is a spy or a witch. Well, does your opinion make a difference? Guilty or not, they all go across the sea to be mm, <clears throat> tried, do they not? I think she should be released. <laughs> no, 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 that's quite, quite no, 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 no. impossible. No, 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 no. She'll be left in my care. And in my care, she shall remain until she's sent off to uh, Sadia. Those are the laws. And here in Friars, Mr. Law. the laws to the letter. I'm afraid I can't release her simply because Dear law. she's uh, innocent. I shall bring this matter to the tower's attention. And so hmm. you shall. Good day, then. Thank and my best to the tower and your <clears throat> mistress. Mistress. Yes, mistress. I, what's my opinion on him? The warden of this prison. He is a true example of why women should be the ones in positions of power. <laughs> the city watch operates this facility, but it's used yeah, exclusively yeah, yeah. for prisoners awaiting transport to Sadir. Sadir, yes, sir. That is kind of like. Oof. But he's off to run off and tell the Terrigan, well, this woman was innocent. Bloody hope he is. I think that's what we're about to do. It appears that someone lives here. How tragic for a so-called civilized society to allow its citizens to be without permanent shelter. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. oh, oh. Me, uh oh. Um. No point of alienating anyone. Yes. My apologies, mistress. I'm not familiar with this city, and I seek a place to get a hot meal nearby. Oh. Um. Well, there's yeah, a couple cause... of really good taverns inside Old Town. I mean, the ghetto. There's this mm. place up on Burrow Crook called the Riverwood Tavern that serves the best roasted gipa in town. It's worth checking out. And if you head further up that way, and you're in the mood for a good ale, the journey met... Actually, no. Forget that. It's closed. I appreciate your help. Pardon, mistress. Do... Do I know you from somewhere? You are familiar to me. I don't uh -oh. think so. Who are you? Um... I have nothing to be ashamed of. She's not really a bit nervous. For all now, she could be a real spy. Um... I'm Kian Alvani. I'm an Azadi apostle. I just arrived in the city. Why are you telling me this? I... Honestly, mistress, I'm not certain. It seemed the right thing to do. Perhaps I simply wanted to speak with someone who is not Azadi to find out what you truly think of my people. 
What Ooh. I think of your people? I find you as Here's what I think. And full of yourselves. You believe you have a right to impose your politics and religion on others. And you actually have the audacity to believe that we should be grateful for that. Your honesty is refreshing, mistress, though I do not agree with your views. It's not a question of agreeing or disagreeing. It's a question of facts. You invaded our lands, you imposed yourselves on us. We delivered you from a brutal and deadly enemy. We liberated your city. We fed your hungry and housed your homeless. We made your land safe again. Without us, you would not be here. Without us, your people would be scattered, broken, dead. Your cities would be in ruins and your temples... All right, Keevan, Jesus broke. Christ. We have only done what we know to be right. We wish only for you to walk the of our goddess, to hear her word and to know her love. Tell me, mistress, how have we wronged you? How have we imposed on you with our charity and goodwill? Charity and goodwill? Is that what they call a military occupation these days? Don't hey, mistake still... gratitude for love, Azadi. A lot of people were grateful that you liberated Mercuria from the Tyran hordes. Others are grateful for what you brought with you. Technology, airships, exotic goods, increased trade. And but these soldiers, you... they've made the Northland safe against our enemies. And Mercuria's streets secure to walk at night, as long as you're human, of course. I'm embarrassed to say there are even those who are happy you've rounded up all the non-humans and stuck them in a ghetto. So sure there are those who are grateful and those who have gained a lot from your presence. But it's not the good David, the whole... As for the silent majority, yeah. well, who wants to rock the boat when there's food on the table, a roof yeah. over your head, and a job to pay the bills? But ask those who are no longer allowed to speak their minds, to walk the streets, or to practice their religion. What do you yeah. think they'll say? Ask a sentinel minstrel, if you can find one. What they felt when you leveled their holiest shrine to the ground to make room for your tower. Oh, so As they not fucking hell. That's not cool. Destroyed because they weren't born human. Because mm. they practiced magic or because they didn't worship your goddess. As the door oh, April's got a lot of sooner mind. Forced to relocate and live inside the walls of the ghetto. She should run for policy. Fate. Jesus. Do you think they will sing your praises? Do you think they've bought into the whole charity and goodwill song and dance? Hallelujah! You can't the of liberating us, but instead you've imprisoned us. You've taken our sovereignty and you've taken our faith. You're even trying to take our individuality away. You want to make us into you. It won't work. In the end, people won't stand for it. If you hadn't come to our lands, we might still be homeless, hunted, hungry, but we'd be free. You'll never take our freedom! Azadi. Freedom is worth a lot more than you will ever know. You have strong feelings regarding this matter. Yeah. Strong feelings? I... I shouldn't be talking to you. I have to go. Wait. I still feel that I know you from somewhere. That's impossible. We're from very different worlds in more ways than you can possibly imagine. Maybe I could learn about your world, and you about mine. I believe you have misjudged our intentions, but you speak with such passion and conviction. It would be wrong of me to simply dismiss you. Perhaps you could show me this ghetto from your perspective, and explain to me how your people have suffered under our rule. You don't understand. It's impossible. And it's too late. Mm. We can't come to an understanding. We're enemies. How can we be enemies when we have just met? I don't... I really have to go. Good luck finding a place to eat. You really should try the Riverwood Tavern in Old Town. Crab Bend used to be a lively neighborhood, but all the non-humans have been forcibly moved to Old Town and the streets completely deserted. Which kind of sucks. But, right. Someone lives here. No doubt driven out of their home by the Oh, zone. so... Let's see if we can get into... It's a speaking tube. <laughs> it's a speaking tube. Hello! Hello! Oh! Uh... And I'm here to inspect the facilities. Prison inspection. Prison inspection. Yeah, prison inspection. Ah. 
One doesn't inspect Friar's <laughs> Keep. But you must have us confused with the city jail over on Cold Stone. Good day. Sorry, wrong door. There's a hole here. Oh, Crow! Hi, Crow! Thought Hi! you just ditch me, didn't you? Well, I have a surprise. Crow, perfect. I need your help. Oh, it's always the same old so What? What? I need to find someone who's locked up in that tower. You can help me. Uh, help? Help you? Really? Mm. Yes. Yes. Yes, I can. Da -da. There's a young woman in a cell somewhere in Friar's Keep. Her name's Zoe. She's got long, dark hair, and she probably looks completely lost. Sounds like someone I once knew. Tell her that, <laughs> I, that we're here to break her out, but we need her help in order to do that. Ask her to look around the cell, check the walls, the floor, the door. See if she can find a way to get out of there. Got it. I won't let you down, April. I do that in, like, Oblivion and Skyrim. I always look up, look at the walls, the floors, the doors, everything, because you never know there's a trap in any of them. So she's saying, like, a, oh. Up here. Just when she goes, oh, my God, a crow could talk. What? Who? What are you? I'm a bird. Crow's the name. Hatch your oh. etc. et cetera. You're Zoe, right? Right. How did you... <laughs> how did you know? <laughs> Got a friend of yours outside. April. She sends her regards. We're breaking you out. Exciting stuff, isn't it? You can... talk. Well Just done, genius. That, huh? Yeah. Right. You're from Stark. Talking bird's a big deal for you. Trust me, it really isn't. No? <laughs> no. Of course, most birds don't speak a human language, but bird speak is a lot more complicated. Most bird brains can't hold both, so I've specialized. Aha. It's a lot less annoying now that I don't understand what all these birds are going on about all the time. So, what's the plan? The plan? I don't have a plan. I thought you were breaking me out. Don't shoot the messenger. I'm just a messenger, see? And I don't want to get shot because of that whole messenger thing. So what's the message? Oh, I forgot about the message. Well... April says, uh, uh, she says, uh, uh, she says, keep that upper lip stiff, trooper. Really? That's what she said? Uh, no. No. <laughs> what she said. Point is, we're breaking you out. you out. Shh, not so loud. They'll hear you. How do you plan to do that? That's where you come in. April needs you to use your investigative skills. In other words, it's your move, baby. 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 Okay, I'll try baby. My best. No, God, no. Let's not do that. So. That's Crow. He's here with April. To April, just say that. Yeah. Okay. So let's have a look around. Anything at all. Anything. Ooh. Ooh. The cell door is locked. There's a hatch. But it only opens from the outside. Oh, hey! Oh, oh. Hello! Open up! Oh, lovely. What's the bloody racket? You're giving me a bloody <laughs> Bloody headache. headache. Oh, it's headaches! It's dark in here, and I'm uh, feeling a bit claustrophobic. Cluster what? I don't like enclosed spaces. Would you mm. mind leaving the hatch open? It'll make me feel better. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Is that right? Dearie me, we can't have you feeling bad, can we? After all, this ain't jail. It's a bloody <laughs> holiday resort, innit? Oh, can you bring me a punch of wine, no. then? Please. Please. I'll be very grateful. How grateful? Uh, I'm not sure. How grateful do you... Will you sing me a song? Uh, song? Yeah. Yeah. A jingle. A ditty. A ditty. A rhythmic series ditty. of musical notes. Yeah, Not once was a god, was a really bit stupid. Uh, he tried, tried to yes. escape the jail. I can do that. Yes. Yes, I can sing you a song. Later. 
Thanks ever so much. I'll just leave the hatch open then, shall I? And I'll come back later, right? For that ditty. The ditty, um, the ditty. Yes. Yeah, yeah. go for it. It'll be all good. Right, now... I can see... The door's bolted and locked from the outside. Even if I could reach that bolt, I wouldn't be able to lift it. Right. Mm. I don't That's know if this will help, but it's a start. I got the guard to leave the hatch and the door open, and I can see the bar that keeps the door bolted. It's locked, and even if I could reach it, mm -hmm. I wouldn't be able to move it. Just something acidic maybe, maybe will do the job, maybe? Out. That's what we're here for, figuring things out. Also rescuing you, of course. For me, it's mostly the last one, not so much the former. <laughs> Anyways, I'll fly down and tell April. She'll know what to do, I'm sure. She's the brains of the outfit. Also the bronze. I'm just the wings and the beak. <laughs> Good old crow. Did you find her? I did, and she's doing fine. They haven't beheaded her yet. I think. <coughs> Can they reattach your head after cutting it off? No. Did you find anything in the cell we can use to get her out of there? The hatch and the door is open. Zoe says the door is locked from the outside with a metal bar. There's a guard, but he's not very attentive. Right. Mm -hmm. So we need something to take care of that bolt and something to get rid of the guard. Any ideas? Magic's always a good answer. You can't go wrong with magic. That's my final answer. Magic. Magic. <laughs> magic won't work in some yeah. keep. The stone walls work as a sort of magical jammer. Okay. The potions would still work. That's chemistry, not magic. And I know good where point. to get potions. Roper clacks. Wait here, Crow. Alrighty. I'll keep my eye on the tower in case anything uh, happens. Hey, 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 don't worry, Zoe. We will save you. Save you attentively. Too bad there's an all run button, eh? Shops and houses are locked and boarded up. There are no magicals left outside of Old Town. Mm. So I can get food. Don't mind me. Don't mind me, guards, when you're not actually paying attention. Boobs! Boobs! Sponsor space cookies! Cookies! Nom! <laughs> Over clacks. We need your help, You're man. Back. How may I assist you this time? Potions! A couple of potions. You've certainly come to the right place. Oh, uh, what do you need? A, a love potion? A acne away. A webbed toes no more. Uh, some sort of a, a scented lubricant? Sun? Lubricants? No, I need no. something that can melt metal. Iron be gone. And something that can knock someone out cold. Knock you out. Extra strength. Tossable or drinkable. I guess it needs to have some range. Tossable. Excellent. One moment. Okay, he's got his demonic eyes. Nah. Thank you. Thank you. The fact is, he didn't ask for any money, so I guess because since I helped, to, well, for what April did to him in the first to make him rehabilitate, so I guess that is nothing. I just hope that he's not going to go like, aided, he realizes he's aiding and abetting and a prison break. Hopefully not! So hopefully that is not the case. Hopefully not. It's all got my mind. India Jones prison escape. Let's see. Right. Wait, can I give it to Crow? Yeah, I can give them to Crow. Right. I need right. you to do something for me, Crow. 
I need you to fly up there with these two potions. Can you do that? No problemo. That's what my talons are for. Just hand them over and crow's your man. Bird. Bird. Birdman. Guy bird. Whatever. I'm that. <laughs> I love crow. Crow is ace. All right. Crow. Off you Just go. Just hand over those potions and I'll deliver them to Zoe. Cool. All right. One and two. Here's the potions. There we go. I come bearing gifts. April got her hands on some potions that might be of use to you. This one melts metal, apparently. Careful, you don't want to spill that on the floor. Or, uh, you know, your pants. So I pour yeah. this on the boat. I guess so. What do I know? Birds don't have any use for chemistry. Mm. Then there's this one. <laughs> What's this for? It's a knockout bomb. You toss it, it breaks, smoke comes out, people fall Oof. over, that sort of thing. Real popular with the kids for some reason. Mm -hmm. Okay, for the guard. So I just toss it at his feet and he'll be knocked out. Will he get hurt? Provided he's not near a, cl or a, a railing or anything like that. Just remember that he would cut your head off without a moment's hesitation. Yeah. It's a Mershnik eat Mershnik world, baby. And only the strongest Mershniks survive. Mershnik. There's a word. Mershnik. Right. Let's try this. Is, where is the guard? Okay, for angles. Trousers back on. Disgraceful. If your mum could see you now, she'd be horrified. Horrified. Ah! Right. Right there. Okay, so how do I. Yes, I'm going to have to get close. Throw it. Yes! <laughs> A nice sleep. Da 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 da. Grab the keys. Oh my god! I'll go blind if I do that again. <laughs> I'll go blind if I say like the shutter's closed. Right, I've got the keys. Got the keys. Got the keys. No. Right. There's a speaker phone. The jailer probably has the key. Right. Well, I've already got keys, so I need go all the way down. Uh, warden, what's happening with lunch? My stomach's killing me. Have to have a guard. Mr. has the day off, Mr. Beerman. You'll just have to wait. Uh, sir, can't we just order something in? Hmm. Well, come <laughs> out of your salary then, Mr. Beerman. Our budget doesn't cover such a extravagances. Ah, oh, clever word. Extravagance is more, yes. <laughs> more yours. Sir, as long as I get some food. Very well. I shall send for a sandwich, the cost of which will be <clears throat> deducted from your next <clears throat> salary. <clears throat> Not happy. Now, I need to get... So I need to get rid of that guard that's over there. Another guard. Another guard. So, we need a sandwich with something in it to make him go woof, or whoop is the good one, whoop. That was a nightmare, that sound. The goblin, is it? the hobgoblin, when he finds a dungeon here, whoop. Right, crow. I heard something that could be of use. There's another guard between this floor and the bottom floor, and he just ordered a sandwich. Ah, the classic caper a la cuisine. The what? A la cuisine. Oh, uh, I thought we were doing a thing now. I was just making stuff up. Sorry. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that information will be helpful or not, but I'll let April figure that part out. 
Thanks. Stay brave. We're not giving up until you're safely out of here. Or dead. <laughs> or dead. No, that's comforting. Jackpot. Maybe. Someone in there's got the munchies, and they just ordered out. Sandwich. From where? Uh, I don't think Zoe caught that part. She just said, sandwich. Sandwich. So it doesn't matter. I can fake it. So, food delivery. That's the way to get in. Let's go then. Save poor Zoe. So, I need... I need something in it. So would I have to go back to, uh, what's his name? I would have to go back to, what's his name to get a potion? Or maybe Ben Rime might be able to do something. Maybe. And if I can, I can go through Old Town now, so I could get through the story faster and going all the way around through the tower and all that gobbledygook. Couldn't I? Tosk? What's Tosk? Not a clue. Herbs. Curiously cookies. Right, so let's go all the way this way. Oh, so that's what it looks like when there's no traffic in it. Great. Are we going to see that cool guy? Cane and stuff. The hell is that? It's just a child. It's just a child. No, no weird characters around here. No blind bulb. Oh, that's a bummer. You'd have liked blind bulb, everyone. All right, Ben Rime. I need your help. Ben Rime? I need some food. My word, child, are you so hungry that you've forgotten your manners? In this place, we say please. I'm sorry, I'm in a hurry. That girl Zoe, she's... What's wrong with her? She's in Friar's Keep, Benrime. What? By the balance, how did no. that happen? I don't know, and right now, I don't care. I need to get her out of there before they ship her off to Sadir. A poor child. But why are you here asking me for food when she needs your help? Because I need to make a delivery to the prison. It's the only way to get inside. Oh. Of uh -huh. course. One moment. And then, why don't you say, like, uh... Here you are, April. That ought to get you inside. Well? Don't waste any time. Go rescue her. Go. So I need something inside it. Can I not get anything inside the sandwich? Like... Are you still here? You must go rescue... Right, okay, no, so it's not being remade. I need to get... Maybe I need something... Yeah, I think I need to go and speak to... Our good friend... Slash old nemesis... For maybe another sleeping potion. Maybe I could put it in the sandwich and then the guard, the guy eats it and goes, Oh! A line made the escape. Oops! Close. Roper clacks at your Roper, service. we need you. Sleeping version. I need to get some guys sleeping. Something that'll make someone fall asleep. Something edible without flavor or smell. Betty by a perennial favorite of ours. <laughs> nah! Ta da! Thank you! Right. Or I forget. Poison sandwich. Potions. Just don't get hungry in the way, bro. Imagine that. Oh man, this journey's so long. I need one bite. Oh no, what have I done? <laughs> don't go that way. Spice up your life, little boy of a girl. Spice up your life. Ah! <laughs> Hello and welcome to the chat, everybody. See, someone's just jumped in. How are you guys doing this afternoon? Hope you're all well. 
Actually, I'm going to double check something. Yes, I did put on all the sound. Thank God. What was that? Did you hear that? Oh, okay, that was creepy. I just heard this. Ah! What the hell was that? Definitely not crow. Right, so I definitely need to deliver the food from here, not giving it to crow. Alright. Go speak. Who is it? You ordered a sandwich. Did I uh, place that order already? Oh, are they? oh never mind. Mr. Bianon has um made it known to all and sundry that he's peckish. So oh, peckish we indeed. Mr. Bianon's stomach stay empty, can we? No, no, no. Enter. Enter, stranger. He's going to do his clear and fruit uh, nonsense again. Mm, but limit. Very good, very good. Uh, leave it on the table, please. Good day. I can bring the sandwich upstairs if you want. Sounded like your man was quite hungry. Hmm? I can bring the sandwich upstairs. Save you the trip. Yes, 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 that'll be fine. Go ahead. The uh, food elevator's on the first floor. Oh, and uh, Mr. Biernon guards the second floor. The food's for him. How do you get past? Okay. Maybe we'd have to knock them out too or later on. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Do, do. Look at that boiler man. Poison sandwich in there. Ooh. Finally, <laughs> I'm starving. Nom nom nom, and then he's gonna go. And then I went back to myself for that reason. Okay. Come on, Zoe, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Hey, what you gonna say about him? He's out cold. <laughs> He's out cold, I think. <laughs> right, so this mean I've got to be very quiet. Walk. We're in this corner, aren't he? Oh, he's right there. Can't keep. Asleep. Hey Andrew. Uh hydrate. Oh shit, that's kind of a bad moment there. Um I don't have anything to drink, uh juice wise. Uh give me a second. Give me a moment. Give me a moment. Right back. So how are you doing today, Andrew? You're going to make a coffee. We'll be right back. Oh, that's okay. Uh, like I said, that was just me getting a hydrate, so I will have my hydrate. Here we go. Oh, that's better. Right, so the guy's gone to sleep. Good. The old crone is gone to sleep. Right. It's the key. Don't be loud. Ooh. Yeah, okay, it's good. We should look at him and go. He's sleeping really heavily. I doubt he'll wake up even if I make a lot of Even if I make a lot of noise. Hail the conquering hero! Na, 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 na. No. Novin. It's locked. Not for long, it ain't. Right. Yep. Yeah. Right. Here's the key. There you go. Onwards and forwards, eh? Onwards and forwards! April, thank you so much for helping me. You're welcome. Yeah. Look, we may not have much time, so let's get out of here before anyone shows up. 
Yes, okay. please. Where are we going? Uh, I haven't thought that far yet. I mean, we can try and fight our way out, but I'm not sure how good you are with the staff. Not very. Yeah. We'll have to find some other way out. Right, so... There's bound to be... an alternative. There's a door over there. I just saw some boots. <laughs> right, so that's the way we came. Oh, right, so there is doors. What's this door? They've got a kitchen, but no kitchen staff. Lucky for us. Door here. Let's see if we can get through it. Hello? I just saw rope. There's rope. We right. need to find a way out now. Hey, help me push this thing over to that wall. There we go. Oh, well, that was really hard. There's some rope. And some boots. <laughs> I'm up. Alright, to that. There we go. Ta da! Now we can escape. Same. Right. She thinking of April. I think. She goes, come on, let's go. Let's get out of here. What do you mean you're not getting involved? Well, that was very you sudden. Are involved, April, whether you like it or not. I understand that you're upset. But this is not my fight. I know that now. Oh, because this guardian person told you. Guardian Leviosa. Maybe not. But he told me that my role in this thing is over. That I'm free. Ooh. So I'm free. What? You're just going to walk away. You're not going to help me. What am I supposed to do? You'll find out. I'm sure. I know I did. Fine. Yeah. God forbid you put yourself on the line again. Did you Ooh, ever think okay. that maybe the reason you saved the world the first time around was because others helped you? Others helped me, yes, and they suffered for it. There's no justice in this universe. No matter how much you give, there's no guarantee you'll ever get anything back. That's no reason mm. to give up. It's called having faith, April. You might want to try it out. That? Look, Zoe, I've told you everything I know. I've helped you as much as I can. You're on your own now. I have others to take care of. Fine. If I have to do this on my own, I will. Have a nice life, April Ryan. April, what the heck is the matter with you? Crow. Mm. Oh, yeah. don't crow, crow me. me. You let that poor girl walk out of here. She needed your help. No, Crow, she doesn't. I spoke with the Guardian and... The April Ryan I knew wouldn't be satisfied with saying, I spoke with the guardian. the guardian. She would have done yeah. everything she could to help her. Well, I'm not the April Ryan you once knew. I'm tired of being responsible for everyone. I'm just tired. Well, too bad. Because the world won't wait around for you to feel untired. And if you're not going to help Zoe, then I certainly am. Crow! Oh, forget it. I have more important things to worry about. So, April's kind of just abandoned Crow yet again! Hey, Crazy, right? Zoe! Wait up! Wait! <laughs> Hey! Hey! Phew. Yeah. You're a fast walker. Long legs and a bad mood. A <laughs> lethal combination. <laughs> so why doesn't April want to help you? Um. 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 I would want to defend her, cause 
I get what she's saying, but yeah, I'll go she defend. She has a lot on her mind. She's selfish. That's what she is. Being busy is no excuse. I don't know what's going on with her, but I can't say that I care anymore. From now on, I'll be your sidekick. <laughs> My sidekick. Look, I'm not the hero type, but I'm not the sit on the sidelines while the world goes to hell type either. If things need doing, I'll help with the doing of them. Of them. <laughs> I had a sidekick before. It's easy. I could do a sidekick. <laughs> and you do the stuff. What right. stuff? The talking and the running and the saving of the yeah. world. If a helpful hint or, you know, an inappropriate joke is needed, bam, I'm right there. Right there. Cool. Oh, oh, I know what that means. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. It means great, doesn't it? <laughs> so, where do we start? Um, that's probably not gross it first. like you have some Don't. experience being a sidekick. I'm a member of the guild. No, that's not a joke. I was actually inducted into the Guild of Sidekicks after April and I saved the world. Oh, they gave cool. me a badge and everything. Sidekick of the month. If only my poor old mom could have seen that. Come to think of it, all she ever saw of me was an egg. Of course, <laughs> the very next month, that annoying man-child with the hairy feet and the chubby face got the badge. What did he do? Carry someone up a hill? <laughs> he didn't even crack a single joke to lighten the mood. No sense of humor whatsoever. A bit of a stone-faced character, then. <laughs> Let's hear what Crow has in mind. What do you suggest, Crow? I suggest we get help. You're young and inexperienced and, let's face it, as lost as a babe in the woods, no sexism intended. <laughs> Me, on the other hand... I'm usually wise to the ways of the world, but I really have no idea what's going on. So, yeah. we get help from someone who's both wiser and more clued in than either of us. Beards are a good indication. Beards? It yeah. signifies age and wisdom, and also sometimes poor personal hygiene. I think those things are actually connected. Who did you have in mind? Uh. There's a bloke that April knows. He's in the city now. He's got a beard, and he's an adult. A perfect combination. His name is Brian Westhouse. Ah, oh, Brian. Okay, let's find this. Okay, so where do we find this Westhouse? As chance would have. Wait, no, it's probably fate. Probably fate. If there's one thing I've learned when things like this happen, it's almost always fate. As fate would have it, I saw Westhouse when I was flying here. I think he was on his way to the South Gate. If we hurry, he might still be there. All right, let's go. Great. Let's go. Let's go. I actually know where the South Gate is, believe it or not. Good, because I'm terrible with directions. Which way is south again? All right. Let's go. Visit Roper's Spells and Filters for premium quality potions, magical ingredients, and... Whee! The pig deal's like... Hello and everyone that is in the stream today. How are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are well. Nice. Zoe, over here. Oh, there! There he is! It was a, like a weirdest wave ever. Good afternoon, young lady. Crow here tells me you're a friend of April Ryan. I know her, yeah. I'm Zoe Castillo. Brian Westhouse. You and... Uh... April had a falling out? Of sorts. Look, I'm sorry, but Crow told me you might be able to help. I might? What is it you need my help with? To get home, I guess. To... Stark. I figured as much. I'm afraid I can't help you with that, Miss Castillo, but I know someone who might. Who? <laughs> Her name is the White Dragon, and from what I understand, Crow... You know where to find her. I do. I can be of assistance. Yes. Yes. Dragon. Like in big, flying, fire-breathing lizard. More like <laughs> skinny, pretty, with legs to kill for. Mm, I don't think she, she breathes does, fire, yeah. although she can get pretty fired up, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Crow. Anyone? Anyone? <laughs> Sheesh. <Swear laughs> I got that. This dragon person. Yeah, she was great. It's where all the hot chicks go, apparently. 
She's in a place called the Dark People's City. If you know how to find it, it moves around with the ocean's currents. Mm. But Crow's just been there, haven't you, Crow? Sure have. I spent several months there learning the ancient art of sitting on my butt. Feathers. <laughs> and you know how to get back. <laughs> sort of. Ish. I know the general direction. I remember the winds. They smelled like cinnamon and rose tea. Wrapped in a fragrant bouquet of fresh bull mule excrement. Really? That's that kind of combo, math, yeah. Because maths just look like confused monkey scribblings to me. And I won't be able to lead a boat there. The waves make me all sick and disoriented. <laughs> we won't have to take a boat. We'll fly. We'll fly! Uh -huh. We'll fly! I'll just wait here while the two of you grow some wings, shall I? No, we just get some Where broomsticks to do hocus pocus. We won't be needing Roads? Where we're going won't need roads. This is turning into two uh, parodies in one. I'm telling you, anything that flies without wings can't be trusted. <laughs> it's against nature, and all that's holy. <laughs> but hey, Calm down, crow. no feathers off my bones. If it comes crashing down, I'm not the one who'll be needing wings. Your mm -hmm. friend, he'll just lend it to us. He owes me a favor. Besides, NPS, that would be the Northlands Parcel Service, has just upgraded their airborne fleet. This baby was one mm. of the first they leased from the Azadi seven years back, and even then, she was getting on. The new ones are faster, bigger, That's what I just said. But she'll do just fine for our purposes. Okay, so... so. You're coming with us? Coming with you? Wouldn't miss it for the world, Miss Castillo. This is one adventure I'm definitely looking forward to. Besides, you'll need me to fly her for you. She takes some getting used to. I don't know. I still don't trust a bird without wings. I'm keeping <laughs> my eyes on you, sister. One wrong move, and <laughs> bam! You'll feel the wrath of my beak. My beak. <laughs> All right. Oh! In the name of the goddess of six, you will lay down your arms and submit to our swords. What? Stay there. Do not make a move. Search the premises. Let no one leave. What in the uh -oh. name of the six is going on? Spare us the theatrics, publican. We know that you shelter rebels. rebels. Oh no! Of course not. This is a peaceful and law-abiding establishment. If that is the case, you will receive an official apology and recompense from the office of the emissary. But I'm afraid we cannot take your word for it. The cellar is clear. There's no one else in here, Apostle. I'll take the second floor myself. Ah, take the floor myself. Ah. Right. Let's go. Oh. Come on, then. Come on, you. I'm invincible. The fight sucks in this game. <laughs> Aya. One, two. Come on, come on then. Well, oh, pretty boy, Nancy boy. Here, yeah. and he's down. Really? Didn't we just kill you? Are you like the Matrix? Ow! Yeah. Come on then. Yeah, come on. Come on. We are waiting! This is so bad fighting. <laughs> right. Check the building. Da 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 
I'll give you one last chance to save your neck, witch. You will help me find someone, or you will die. And not just you. We will send the proprietor of this tavern to Sadir to stand trial for treason. As Ooh, your friends have just yep. left harbor, their ship will be boarded and the supplies confiscated. Do you know how the Azadi punish smugglers? Please. Their feet and hands are bound. They are weighed down with metal. And then they are dropped into the ocean. Please, let them be. You like the old castle, these gangsters. I have no quarrel with you or <laughs> your compatriots. I compatriots! Compatriots! The, my call, the scorpion. The scorpion? Oh dear. What do you know of him? If I... If I tell you about the scorpion, will you let us go, Benrime? Me, the shipment? No. But if you lead me to the scorpion, then yes. I will let you and your friends go. You'll have your food and medicine. Leave the boat be, yeah. Azadi. Please. There are no weapons aboard. It poses no harm to your people. It's in oh your God. hands now. Hands now. Very yeah. Well. I will take you to to the scorpion, but only if you give me your word that you will harm no one else. You have my word. May the stars follow okay. me for what I am about to do. To save your own skin, eh? Turn off my stupid Alexa. I heard it going boom. The background. Uh, right. Hope you guys can hear me okay. Uh, game just as well. I might turn around the game a wee bit if you guys aren't from hearing me. I can easily do that. Is the whole thing held by one cable there, or is it? Atta it is attached to the. It's attached to the blimp, right? How are we doing? Just fine. Yeah. This ship's a real beauty. She basically mm -hmm. flies herself. She just needs a tiny nudge now and again. You guys. But other than that. So, yeah. Mr. Westhouse. Call me Brian, please. Brian! When did you come to Arcadia? Oh, that was a long, long time ago. Too it's long. a bloody immortal from the signs I of traveled it. traveled across the divide in 33. 1933, that is. What? And you're how old exactly? Oh, I may be getting on, but I'm not that old. No, I got unstuck from time, and I was caught between worlds for a while. Hmm. Not a pleasant experience by any measure of things, but I got out and I made a life for myself in Mercuria. I'm never going back to start. And I'm fine with that. I've made peace with my past. Arcadia is my home now. Fair enough. Uh, I wonder where in Stark, Brian, where came in from. Stark did you come from? Boston, USA. Back when there was a USA. Hell, <laughs> back when there was a Boston. <laughs> you were thinking you're Boston and not get out of it. How did you end up ah. here? Are you a shifter? Most certainly not. I mean, if I was, I uh. would probably have gone back at some point. No, I made my way through the divide by more unconventional means. I'm not that old, oh. mind you. Something happened that got me unstuck from time. But you already it said that. the best idea I ever had, but... Still, here I am in good health and with all my limbs intact. I, I shouldn't complain. Hmm. Okay, it looks like he's seen a lot of Arcadia. Lot of this world. I'd say so. When Mercuria was invaded by the Tyrant Hordes ten years ago, I was forced to leave the city. I first traveled hmm. east across the Northlands to a place called Irhad, the Sun Empire, and then south across the Great Ocean Coming? to the continent called the Southlands. After that, well, there's hey, Andrew, you got a siphon in there. <laughs> I've even been to the Azadi Empire. But I have to say that I like the Northlands and Mercuria best of all. I, it feels like home. There is no place like home. There is no place like home. Uh, the Tyrant? What are the Tyrant? It's, he said Southlands, so Andrew's. 
I'm just saying. Years ago, they South Ward, South Flint. It was quite close. What? The Azadi killed them all when they liberated the city. If there are any left, they're few and scattered. The Tyrant took the city during a time of great upheaval, but they didn't hold mm -hmm. it long. The Azadi arrived in their ships soon after and drove them out. It's almost frightening how quickly the Tyrant were wiped out. The Azadi showed no mercy. Mm. We might actually get this whole game done today, hopefully. Probably could tell me more about Where the Azadi. Where did the Azadi come from? Far west, Everywhere. Almost ten days' journey by boat. In their airships, however, or cloud ships, it doesn't take many days to cross the ocean. You've visited their continent. I've passed through it, so to speak. Their capital, Sadir, is just amazing. It's built across a huge river delta where six rivers... At least I'm not having too it's much difficulty place. with a camera. They let you just wander per free se? through their city. I passed blah, 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 blah. in their lands. It's not close to outsiders, and as long as you respect the Azadi and their customs, they give you passage. It's such a different culture from mm. what we're used to, but... So you can't fart in public, then. interesting <laughs> people from my visit to be highly educational. <laughs> what they're doing in Mercuria, though, it's certainly controversial on one hand they brought freedom and peace on the other hand they've just kind of whipped us all they whipped them they down. rounded up the magicals stuck them in a ghetto and god knows what they intend to do with them next when do we get yeah. to the dark people city from what our feathered friend said it'll be another day or so are you okay yeah yeah i'm just feeling a bit restless well there's not much to do here you can Look around the cabin for a bit, talk to Crow, or take a nap back in the hold. There's a bed there. Thanks. Maybe I will. Yeah, this is a hell of a cabin, eh? <laughs> Let's go outside. The hold is back there. And the bed. Right, so... Looks very complicated. Sky and ocean as far as the eye can see. It's really beautiful. Really beautiful? What ocean? I don't see no stinking ocean. I see clouds. Gee, Crow. Crow, crow looks a bit worse for wear. <laughs> oh, let's talk to Crow. I'm feeling seasick. Your air. What? Seasick. Aren't you used to flying? Flying? Yes. Flying is no problem. Flying is flapping your wings and praying for a good tailwind. This isn't flying. This is torture. So why don't you jump out there and fly instead? <laughs> what? And catch a cold? Are you kidding me? You do know that it's freezing out there, don't you? Yeah, and please it's not like I can keep up with this infernal machine. My wings are made for comfort flying, not marathons. <laughs> no, I'll stay here. I'll just find a corner to go throw up in instead. Oh, nice. Poor crow. Bro could probably tell me a few things about April. How yes. long have you known April? That depends on how you look at it. Eight we go way years? Back, but I haven't really seen her since <laughs> way back. Eight years? She sent me on my merry way. She wanted to go find herself, which actually means go lose everyone else. I can recommend mm. it, though. It's very liberating. I went off to find myself recently, and I have nothing but good things to say about it. You see, I was about to get married, and... To a bird. Wait, what? I mean, not a woman. Well, yeah, I was gonna say a bird. Yeah, a female bird. Yeah. Someone with wings, like you. Yes, that's right. A bird. Anyway, <laughs> so the idea <laughs> of settling down, building a nest, starting a family. I don't know. I started freaking out. So I went on a journey of discovery. <laughs> <laughs> a journey of discovery. You went on a journey of discovery. Inner discovery. A quest for personal understanding, mm -hmm. a mission of self-realization, a voyage of inward fulfillment, a trek to the... Okay, okay. Yes, I get it. You wanted to find yourself. It's brilliant. You desert everyone, abandon your responsibilities and relationships, and focus completely on your own personal misery. Uh, I don't think that's the way you're meant to do it. Soul. It's a douche for you the know, soul. Bro, I think you may have uh, misunderstood what finding yourself is all about. You think? What? Yeah. No, April showed me how it's done. I can't believe I didn't do it sooner. I feel so much lighter. Not a care in the world. 
Not a good role except, model, you know, the total April, yeah. Abject misery in my heart and soul. Yeah, I... I would reevaluate that, Crow. I would totally reevaluate that. So you abandoned your fiancé to go on a selfish journey of inner discovery. Abandoned is a strong word. Mm -hmm. Left? Deserted? Forsook? Yes, yes, and yes. Slipped away in the dead of night? Sure. Okay, ninja. But it was all for the best. I obviously wasn't ready to, you know, become a responsible, grown-up, magical bird. Where does one go to find oneself, I ask. Granted, I only asked myself, and I probably should have gotten the second opinion, but there you go. So I decided to seek the center of all wisdom and knowledge in Arcadia. This dark uh, evil city. city. No, no, no. Oh, okay. Some fortune teller in Zahn. She stiffed me. What? It was actually blind luck that I ended up in the dark people's city. I never intended to go there, but it was a real blessing, I tell you. Okay. These guys, they let me read anything I wanted. And I've learned a lot. Like, for example, did you know that a Diavon water snake can grow to be almost 200 meters long? I didn't. I didn't <laughs> dear. Either, because now I'm really freaked out by water, but there's not much else to do in the place except read. Read, eat. Read, sleep, read, go to the bathroom, and read at the same time. <laughs> it's very, very dull. But all that introspection gave me perspective. I wisened up, and now I'm ready. Ready to get married? Ready to admit that I'm scared out of my feathers about getting married. So no, still on that journey. <laughs> this is what just asked about that. No, it's asking me, April. April. I don't understand what happened to her. Oh, she was the sweetest, prettiest, nicest girl you could have ever imagined. And she was a real trooper. Save the world and all. You don't see a lot of people doing that these days. Right. But things didn't turn out the way she thought they would. She couldn't go back to her world, first because she was afraid, and then later because she lost her powers. On top of that, the Azadi were after everyone from Stark. Everyone with special powers, everyone who was allied with the Magicals. In the end, I think April just snapped. She was so angry. She felt so betrayed. She had to take it out on someone. And that's why she, she went after the anxiety, yeah. Exotic. Okay. I wanted to stick with her. I really did. Despite the yelling and the bitterness. But in the end, she just up and left me. Right in the middle of nowhere, too. Yeah, I tried looking for her. But after a while, I gave up. I got the distinct feeling she didn't want me around anyway. Oh, crow. So, I left to begin a new life. I don't think there's Poor anything crow. you could have done, Crow. Sometimes the people we know and love change. And sometimes that means we have to move on. Oh, but that's kind of harsh, man. What powers did April lose? Her special thingy, being a shifter. First, she didn't want to go back to Stark. And then, one day, she couldn't. Her powers went poof. And no one knows why. Ooh. <laughs> What? <laughs> what? Why did you get... mm. Because it's spooky. Also, <laughs> I like saying it. It makes my beak vibrate. You don't think she lost her powers because she felt her powers were the cause of her misery? It's... Of course, I... I wouldn't know what... Huh? Seems to me <laughs> that she was scared about facing reality again. And she decided that her powers would only bring more pain. So she lost them. Oh, oh, that's, uh, uh psychology, psychology yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Oh, brilliant. You human females from Stark are really clever. So, hey, if we hit April with a really big frying pan, she'll come to her senses, right? <laughs> no! 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 Yes, yes, it's called therapy. I read that somewhere. <laughs> well, not read, more like heard. Yeah, that's... In a seedy tavern near the docks. Oh, no. After Eleven thimbles of Mary Menstrom's yellow fire. You were drinking. No. Dinner, on a Monday. <laughs> but I remember the fella who told me. Big lad. Arms as thick as oak trees. A stunning collection of scars. Nice eye patch. A real therapist he was. Uh, it's not a therapist. Wait, maybe it was rapist. <laughs> Oh, 
dear. Oh, crew, you're the highlight of this entire stream. Uh, this my watch has a burning question. Yes, What's it is. Like being a talking bird. My beak is a finely tuned instrument of love. When I Duh. speak, girls tremble, and also guys. Guys tremble too, but not in the same way. Right. Yeah. It's nice chatting with you, Crow. It's been very informative. Glad to help, doll. 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 Um. I mean, independent and self-reliant female person who's not an object to be ogled at or used solely for my own personal amusement and pleasure. <laughs> oh, dear crew, you are just... You're just the wit of this entire game. Alright. Right, it is attached to the blimp. Right, because I was wondering if it was a friend and just one bit. But that was quite funny. I, I actually enjoyed that interaction. That was very chill. Ooh, here we go. The Dark People's City. All that we see or seem. Yeah. How's this gonna play out? What are they gonna say to us? Because we're like, hi! Welcome to our oh. city. The White of the Kin is expecting you. She is? Who? That's the white dragon, Zoe. How did she know I was coming? I stopped asking those kinds of questions a long, long time ago. You just have to start buying into stuff like destiny and precognition, or you'll go nuts. She waits in the library. Yeah. Follow me. Oh, is this when he's going to do that weird thing okay. again? Get the no point in asking any questions, is there? Follow me. Absolutely not. It'll only make your head hurt. <laughs> Wait for it. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Wait for it. Oh. Okay, see if we can wind him up. Follow me. Okay, fine. Pick up the pace a bit. Wait, can I do it now? Follow me. No? So we're at the top of the tree instead of the bottom of the tree. That's not too bad, so that saves a bit of time. Hey, Crow. This is a really strange place. Tell me about it. I couldn't sleep for the first couple of weeks. All those fancy lights and the spiders freak me out. Right, spiders. and you were s Oh, exactly. yeah, I was about to say. Yeah, oh god, no, I wouldn't like to stay here then. God, no. Bloody spiders and all. God no. I did like this library. This place is fucking cool. So cool. Really is. Dudes are uh, You can ask us to be quiet this bit because we are resting. Okay. No legs. Hovering. But yeah, I've seen weird things. I've seen weirder things. There we go. Oh, Brian, how did you get in front of me? All the weird sounds. Mm. There are some huge things out there. I hope those um windows are thick. Well, it must have been if it's been here for eons, Zoe. Probably. I'm sure of that. Tons and tons of books. Well, there's no magazines. I would definitely say there's tons of books, so I... She's there. I wonder what she's He's reading. Me to see the white dragon. Hello! And Crow's just like... Hi! Hi, I'm Zoe. How fascinating. You're here. And yet you're not. Can I touch you? Can you... What do you mean by... Who's that? Oh, I forgot. Oh. This is my friend Brian Westhouse. He's a... Um... A traveller, I guess. You sound... So familiar. You've heard my name before? Your presence, mm. your being, sounds familiar. And also... Also disconcerting. Mm. I feel a prickling on my skin. 
what do you call it? Goosebumps? So something's My not right with Brian. I don't wish to perturb you. Maybe I should just leave you. No, please. Stay. Perhaps it's... I'm sure it's just me. You see, I don't but understand then... this body yet. Um... I don't know what any of these feelings mean. I apologize. You're most welcome here, traveler. Thank you, ma'am. I'll leave the two of you alone while I peruse this magnificent library. He's been a bit off. You've come Even when I was playing as April, April came to something went wrong, yeah. You're stuck. I'm oh, stuck here in Arcadia, yes. I need to go back to Stark. But this isn't yeah. the only place you're stuck. You're stuck in life, like driftwood to a river. Oh. You lack direction. You lack faith. Maybe so, but that's why it's important that I go back home. People there need me, and I want to be there for them. I don't want to be adrift anymore. I want to be where I'm needed the most. And okay. that will bring you home, Zoe. Your commitment to your friends, your belief in yourself. And your abilities. As long as she doesn't disappear with our clothes, she's cool. <laughs> it's easy. You're not really here. That's what you said earlier. But it doesn't make sense. I'm right well, here. Well, she connected Dreamer, yeah, yes. but then. And no. You're unlike anyone I've ever met. You belong to the story time. Okay. Story time. Now you're being cryptic. I've had enough of that. I can't take any more riddles. Just tell me what it means. I'm sorry. It might mean it's something from the very start it just of the is. game, that With guy. With all due respect, I just want to get home. I want to help my friends. I want to stop the bad guys friends. from winning. I want to... I want to be myself again. The last time I was here in Arcadia, I fell asleep. And when I woke up, I was back home in Stark. Right, How did I do yeah. That? When I fell asleep on the airship on my way here, I didn't disappear. That's yeah, because you, were just... you didn't dream. If you dream the right dream, it becomes reality. You can go anywhere you right, wish. Okay. To go back to your own world, you just have to wake up. You mean this is all a dream? This isn't a dream. Anyway. But you're dreaming. I'm confused again. So like a bridge. All I need to do is go to sleep and dream about home, and then I'll wake up and be home. Maybe. Something like that, maybe. I've never met anyone like you. I only know that there are some who have a strong connection with the world of dreams. And you are one of them. I'll just have to take your word for it. Mm. Help me fall asleep. Help me dream or wake up or mm -hmm. whatever it is you said I need to do to get home. Circle is confusion. Yeah. I have to be where I'm needed the most. Come here. See. You must find her, Zoe. You must help her. Wherever she But she, she knows is, about it too. That's where you're needed the most. Whoa! What? Where did she go? What <laughs> did you do to her? Did you use magic on her? No. I didn't do anything to her, funny bird. She left this place on her own. But, but she just vanished. Oof! I know. Isn't it fascinating? There's no one else like her. She's special. Special. I've never met a human girl who hasn't been special. For all I know, they've all got strange powers and important destinies. I just hope she's okay. You gonna call him funny? Oh. Most interesting. See, Brian is making me very suspicious. Crossroads. We're on the crossroads to where we are going next. Alright. Whoop! I'm gonna pop out of nowhere. Whoop! Hey! What? This isn't. Yeah, he's um, iffy as fuck. Yeah, I totally agree. He was a bit off in the last episode. I think it was the last episode when I saw him. Where am I? Who am I? <laughs> I'll kill him. So, uh, no, no, that's, that, I'm in prison. No, it's, um, I, um, let's read that one. Um, where am I? I thought the white dragon would send me back to my world, but this definitely isn't. So what are we doing here? 
Oh, it looks like a swampy village. Some kick-ass torches. It can't be, but it does look like the skeleton of an animal. A very large animal. Yeah, I know, even I'm agreeing. I'm agreeing with you, Andrew. I'm totally agreeing with you there, man. Just totally agreeing. Right. Very crazy. It There's an old like boat. They built this town from bits and pieces of everything, even boats. Yeah. They're definitely not. Um. Oh yeah, no, I remember. Yeah. Oh. Is that a fireball or a firework? I oh, remember. They're celebrating something. Someone does this. Someone doesn't feel right. Um, because like I says, I do remember playing this game, but like I said, it was years and years ago when I last played this. Closed and locked. I don't think there's anyone in there. At least you're not running up to people who's away and going, I don't know her. Or, have we found an ancient post box Whoever yet? Here, they must be using boats to ferry between the different parts of the city. It's a sizable town spread all over the swamp, but the walkways don't cover all of it. I would probably need a boat to get across there. Mind you, it's fucking cool to look at. Oh, I'm at a pier point. I'm at a pier point. Nice. Let's see what this is about. So I got nowhere else to go. Is oh! That April? It's April. April! She can't hear you. You might as well shout. Hey, bro! What April? The fuck's that? Dear God. Some of the acting sometimes is a bit cryptic, isn't it? So who are we going to play now? run south before the ice breaks. Though I'm ah. guessing Mercuria is out of the out question. Of the question. Arr. We lost nice. good people. We got careless. Ah, we were as careful as we could be. We just got unlucky. It was bound to happen sooner or later. Let's just hope we got enough intelligence out of it to justify the losses. I wish I could say that's the case. Yeah. The fact is, they're getting too strong for us. They tore us apart down there. Easy as... Proverbian pie. Woman. <laughs> the raven I know is tougher than that. There's enough doom and gloom in this place already. Which is why I'm going back. To Mercuria? Are you sure that's wise? We I like this character. We go Pirate. there. It's all the same. They're coming and they won't stop. Not until we strike at their heart. Mercuria, the tower. Huh, the tower? It'll take more than you and your band of merry rebels to topple that one, Raven. And even if you do, you think that'll stop them? No. We need to stay strong. Build our allegiances, recruit more people, and keep the enemy from our doorstep. Our time and patience will decide the victor. We don't have this ain't a game of risk. Come on. Mercuria. We have to act now. We have to take the war to them. No. I'm inclined to agree, Raven, but we're not strong enough. Not yet. If you stay here, we can train more people, build our strength, and... And talk about how someday we'll crush the enemy and take back our lands and our cities. But then that could be overwarming, yeah. Best. Talk. They murdered my friends. They arrested our most trusted ally in Mercuria, and they're probably moving north even now. And you say we should wait? I'm done waiting. Ah, the Azadi don't have a clue where we are. Trust me, Raven. We're safe here. Well, Besides, I don't know about your friend now, Blabbin, probably. That's the screw us over. Swamps between us and the Bay of Fire. Even if the Azari burns, should burns, burns, burns. Them, the scouts will give us two days' warning. We'll sink their boats before they even know what happens if they're sneaking around. Even so, I can't just sit here and wait. I have to do something. I swear, Raven, you'll get yourself killed one of these days. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder if that's not what you want. But if it's south you want to go, if you want to take your war to the Azadi, then fine. You'll have my boat. I'll take you where you want to go. Now, you'll have to excuse me. We still have to unload the grain and move all the supplies into storage. 
I'll come by later and give you a hand. I just have a few people I need to speak with first. <laughs> Sorry. The captain got the ship out of Mercuria just in time. Another few hours and they would have arrested everyone, I'm sure of it. Can I go up? Alright, okay, I have to go up. Yep, it up D. Can I go faster than this? I'm just getting a Star Wars Ewok village ripoff going on in my mind here, eh? Anyway, there's the pier that Zoe's at. Look, there's the entire bit there. That's clever. Convenience! Arkady crap. Is there anybody that is around here? There are lots of new faces since I was last here. It would be easy for the Azadi to infiltrate the city. That's a risk we have to take, I guess. Ooh, yeah, that's not... Maybe, how do I get down? I get down. I must, I'm guessing I have to go to lower... Ah, oh, right, there we go. There's... Oh, that's cool! Cool views! You know? Cool view and all. Wait, can I... Okay. Oh! Kara. A moment, April. Please make oh. sure the herbs are distributed to the lieutenants. They are each responsible for their group. His head's clipping at the end lead. there. Unless he's got... Yeah. Thank the balance you escaped, Mercuria, and that Bryn and Chowan made it here with the supplies. Your efforts are much appreciated. Kara, about oh. Benrime, we need to do... She put her yeah. life on the line for us. We won't forget that well, any She was your best soon. friend. We'll sing her song at the tables tonight. The Azadi will be keeping her alive until they can ship her west. They like to have a show trial before executing their prisoners. Coming if up on trial are us! With me south, I can... You intend to take on the entire Azadi army by yourself? No, April. This war will have its victims, and mm -hmm. you'll have to learn to live with that. You may have a death wish, but not everyone shares your lack of faith in the future. In time, we shall prevail. I've dedicated my life to fighting the Azadi, Kara. What makes you say that I have no faith? Mm. You've already given up your life. You don't fight because you want to destroy them. You fight to destroy yourself and your demons. Granted, Everyone's your quite apparent to that, aren't they? ...have strengthened us. The enemy fear and curse your name, and you've made them tread more cautiously in the north. But both you and I know you're not doing this for mm. any greater cause. You're doing this because it's the only thing you have left. And I can't have you taking our people with you on a suicide mission. So we let Benrime rot in prison, is that it? We let them take her to their country where she'll die because she helped us? Yes, we do. Benrime wasn't, isn't stupid. She knew the risk. Good cover she of the words there. It was a dangerous game to play, and she played it as safe as she could. Unlike you. I don't accept that. I can't leave her to die. Accept it or not, you're not taking anyone south. We have enough trouble protecting our homes and our supplies. We can't afford another setback. I can see the global the idea of it, yeah. Their own decisions. That they do. And you may find that for once, you're on your own. Now, get if you'll excuse me, I have other matters to attend to. I'll see you at dinner tonight, April. And thank you again for bringing us the supplies. Without them, we wouldn't have lasted through the winter. Right, so... That's a good bit before she appears, then. I have to keep going down the way. Naane? Oh, Naane! It brightened my heart and spirit to see you here. Oh god, boss. Fuck, look at this girl. So she's I heard probably that brought you had here. Mercuria, but I was worried nonetheless. And now the stars have brought you back to us. How did you get out of Mercuria? I heard they shut all the gates and posted guards at all exits. As a stowaway on trade ship bound for Corazon, and on a leap first back north along the old pass. As it was generous enough to share her mount with me. I'm glad you're safe. Mm. Good thing Bryn and Chuan had just left with the supplies. They were the lucky ones. The stars shine on all of us, April Am. Until you what can open your mouth and betray it, yeah. What about Benrime? 
I'm sure they don't feel so lucky right now. Fortune often has a dark side, but there may still be a chance to aid the innkeeper. What? How? I have just been told that someone arrives from Mercuria with word of Benrime. He wishes to speak with you. Who? A stranger. A friend. A messenger. He wishes to meet She's you. She's setting a her throw up. He will speak that's, with you. Yeah, that's what's hap that's what that sure part was. was. Friend? How did he find us? Would I lie to you, Aprilon? I'm sorry, Naani. Of course not. I trust you. I'll go right away. Mm. Listen, if it turns out this man has important information and I have to go back to rescue... I would not let you walk alone, Aprilon. Go now. He arrives soon. Mm. Okay. I could truly see how that's all ruled out now. If I get to the other side there, I must have to go... Bit of a... Ah! There you go. I was jokingly gonna go along, take the long way, and that would have been a no-no. So it wasn't April that fired that. What's that? I think the celebrations might be getting out of hand. I need to speak with Kara about that. Kara, stop celebrating so much. Right. So, if we look this way, do you think we should be able to see Zoe in a minute, any time? This is it. But where's the messenger? Who are... Who are you? We all kind of now know who he's going to be. I think we all know who he's going to be. I can maybe understand why I don't have many streamers on these latest streams. It's primarily because of that email verification to stop that uh, fake accounts dropping comments and adding and following and stuff. Ah, so he came from this way. Alright. I think that's why I haven't had many as much viewers of late. Because some people don't like that, but... It's the only way to stop all that constant up notification from the fake ones streaming while popping in going, ah, following when they're not following, following. Who well, wasn't him here? Fuck's sake. Okay, so who was it then? What is that strange? Perhaps it was a message to someone. Hey. If it wasn't him. I'm here. I have kept my part of the bargain. Now it's your turn. I have done what you asked of me, Azadi. Your scorpion waits on the pier. Alone. Yeah. Leave. If I ever see you again, my sword will kiss your throat. Mm -hmm. What I have done, I am already dead. Yeah. I'm so surprised that Zoe isn't there then. When she would, uh... Oh, wait! There she is! It's hard to believe that anyone would build a city like this. There she goes! From the white walls and gleaming towers. I was actually thinking to myself that we wouldn't have seen Zoe, but look at her, you can see her. So we wait to chime it in. That is cool. I did not notice that ever in the past. I just was like, straight in. That is weird to see! That little details, it's the little details. Is she gonna end up with the beer? There she goes. So we look at her and go, well, there's April. Even back then we pe we had some little hidden details and I never noticed till now. So sitting there watching. I will walk up. Uh, this is it. Uh, but where's, where's the, the messenger? Here I am. Who are... You. I, I remember you. From Mercuria, but Oh, you're... no, and then... You're the Azadi. What are you doing here? Have you been... 
Shit. You followed me here. I swear by my sword I did not follow you. I came here by other means. I wish you no harm, mistress. You spoke to me with honesty back in the city, and I respect that. So what the hell are you doing here? Yeah. What the hell? You brought soldiers with you. There's civilians here. Women and children. I did not bring any soldiers. I am alone. Then why? Please, let me explain. I'm an apostle. We are missionaries. We bring the word of the goddess to unbelievers. Can't see if Zoe's still there so watching. Cold steel and swift yeah, death. Instead of sermons and prayers. We are my eyes. Yep, she's still there. She's like... Eh? <laughs> of my mission. The goddess is the Do you think she'll start doing this? April! Bring her April! Look out! <laughs> kid, I have seen and heard many things in my brief time here. She is actually looking at us. I like... have seen with my own eyes how ignorance and fear are leading some of my people astray. How Sorry. arrogance and distrust threaten to corrupt our mission. I have witnessed deeds. Deeds of which you spoke so passionately when we first met. That have lifted a veil from my eyes. Does the goddess, in her infinite and unquestionable wisdom, truly want us to commit these deeds on sovereign mm. peoples in these sovereign lands? When we last met, mistress, your words awoke something inside of me. Okay, she's out. I have never oh. questioned my mission or my faith. To do so would be to question my entire existence. And still, now that we meet again, I'm reminded of the parting words of an old friend. Words dismissed too quickly. And I find myself torn. Mm. Bravo. That's a very convincing speech, Apostle. You Apostle almost have been there for a moment. But the fact is, you're an enemy assassin. You're in our city, and you didn't come here to talk to me. I am an assassin. And my mission is plain and undisputable. Only... I believe now that the goddess has led me here for another reason. Mm. Led me to you. Why else would she have brought us together? First in Marcuria and now here. If it wasn't to show me, show us a different path. Sorry, I don't believe in destiny or divine intervention. Not anymore. She's been a bit I resistant there, that like. Things are meant to happen. Call it destiny. Call it the will of the goddess. Call it chance. But do not call it coincidence. So what now? Hmm. You expect me to just let you walk out of here to accept that you've seen the light? No. Yes. I, I don't know what to think anymore. I only wish to speak with you for a little while longer. To understand. To open my heart to a different truth. I believe the goddess wishes to speak to me. To me. And not to those who would interpret her word to suit their needs. And what's your goddess telling you? That my path... A path I have never even considered questioning until this moment. Maybe one that leads into shadows and not into light. But maybe well, you're coming out of shadows to light. Enlightenment, Azadi. You've come to the wrong person. The name is Kian, mistress. I cannot claim that I came here to find enlightenment. Quite the opposite. Yet now I'm starting to see that a great injustice may have been done to the peoples of the Northlands. If that is so, it's my duty to help undo the damage. You're planning no, on turning no. against your own? I will never take up arms against those I have sworn to protect. But I intend to return to Sadir and inform the Six, our Empresses, about what goes on in the provinces. Why? But then, why because it is not right. will they listen? They it won't. It is certainly not the will of the Goddess. And Especially all those crazy women in that been courtroom. I still don't understand. They were walked up in power. Leon. Faith, mistress. I Maybe. fear I was losing it. But I was wrong. My faith is as strong as ever. It because power corrupts. Misplaced. I... I guess I owe you a name. I'm April. April. I am pleased to make your acquaintance. You shouldn't stay. If anyone sees you... You will not tell them. I don't have an easy time trusting anyone, as a. Hmm... But I'm beginning to believe that you are the real thing. An honorable man. I try to be. But I still don't understand why you're here. And I don't understand why Na'ane told me that you're... Oh! And that was the flare. That was them! Shit! Well! Now 
Uh, warp bound, and that's the end of the resistance. The end. Shit. Ah, oh, of course. Make a dramatic entrance, eh? Da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, it's Cap. It's that douchebag. It's him. Ugh. Captain Douche. I knew you were a weak apostle, but I never imagined you would go so far as to betray your own people. Vamon? What in the name of the goddess are you doing? Your job, Alvani. Destroying mm. the enemy. Or did you forget that was why you were sent here? There are women and children in this city, Vamon. Civilians. They're all equal in the eyes of the goddess, are they not? Oh, of course. Wives of terrorists, children of terrorists, sinners. Every one of them. As for this one, is this who you were sent to kill? To kill? No. I was about to tell you. I did not know who you were. I came to find the scorpion and I found you in his place. Scorpion? That's... All oh, right. People gave me after I put the fear of the balance into them. You, him. Your well, mouth is filled with venom, which even to the last, you are truly beneath us. And you, Alvane, arrest him. Lower your weapon, soldier. I'm an apostle. No more, Kian Alvane. Oh you boy. Hey, Mr. G. You have strayed from the path, and you have forsaken the mission. Forsaken! You become soft, oh. like a spoiled fruit. You actually oh. empathize with these heathens and it's murders. Key, I'm, I'm going to have to fight these guys. You, oh, apostle, so. have committed a mortal sin. You have lost your faith. <laughs> I can see in the background. Right? You are not it going not to escape. Straight from the path. It is not I who have lost my faith. What are we doing to these people? Why are we trespassing on their land? This is not the will of the goddess. No! No, it's not. Your whole grows oh. Like Still, the goddess this guy is merciful, such a douche. I don't like so him. I. I'll give you one more chance to prove your loyalty and save yourself from eternal damnation. Do Boy. what you came here to do. Kill this murderous witch. Kill the scorpion. I need to stall them. Uh, plead. Her life must be prepared. No, I have no idea. It was only she was only protecting her people. Yes. Yeah. Just get it over with. I came here to face the scorpion, but I didn't know who the scorpion was. Uh, I could never harm you. Very well. You've made your choice. Kill her. And that's when so he's like, Oh no, April! Now she's a martyr. I hope that's no April screaming there. Don't tell me you <laughs> What you're doing here is wrong. Totes, man. Protecting our people from terrorists. Innocence, man. Stronghold. Tell me, Kian, what exactly am I doing wrong? Being a These douche for one. Defending their homes and lands from invaders. Where in the At least Kian's realized that. Them. You've fallen far deeper than I thought possible, Elvani. It will be entertaining to see you stand trial. It oh, will don't we? not happen when the emissary. Oh, they're not going to listen to you now. Ordered you arrested, Elvani, after you let see? the keeper and that smuggler vessel go. It was clear to the mistress that your loyalties were no longer with the Empire. Although, ironically enough, you were the one who led us here. I'm sure that will count in your favor at the trial. So maybe they'll even let your body lie in a marked grave. Take him away. I'll make you pay for this family. So I told you I that all those women in that big chamber were gonna fucking keep their power. They wouldn't let anything happen. So no matter what he was thinking or it's gonna do. Oh can I slap him? Can I can we just kick his ass? Murderous douche. Oh! Wait, is that, um... Dead, Juan. Oh, Juan, thank God. Dead! Dead! But there is nothing we can do now. If you do not quiet down, we will soon be dead ourselves. Oh, come on. We might as well be. Listen, they're killing them. Every one of them. What's the point of surviving if we're alone? That's it. I'm going out there. No, Brim. 
No. There are too many. We will make our way to safety and regroup. But first, we have to help her escape. You yes, please. With us. It is too dangerous. You will not survive. You need to fall asleep again. But they're already searching the houses. If we stay, won't they kill us? When you fall asleep, you disappear like dew to the sun. You travel. I have seen it with oh, my you eyes. Oh, you your clues stay here, so... How can I fall asleep here, now? Here's a pan! Bring. Bong! Hand me that pouch over there. They're coming closer. Do as I um. Quickly now. What's that stuff? Cover your face, Bryn. You breathe deeply. <laughs> what is it? it Someone to make you relax. Magic. It will make you sleep. Breathe in. There's that. Don't let anyone escape shit. They're yeah. Coming. Chuan, we need to get out of here now. It's not working. I'm not falling asleep. Breathe. Relax. Slowly. Deeply. I'm trying to, but it's not helping any. I'm only feeling woozy. <laughs> We're here. He's gonna be high as hell. Go. Not getting asleep. Oh, no, Brim. Oh, man, and that's them. Oh, man. Uh oh. I don't like this. Is this been Brian's? Hello? Our suspicions. Please don't be Brian. Funny don't be bird. Brian. Is that you? No. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I didn't see you. Are you looking for something? Wait, no. What are you? Oh, God. I bet it was Brian. Oh, my head. Faith. Don't come. Oh, man. God. So that's the white, white, white dragon gone. Fuck. Man. Are you here? He promised me he'd stay. Yeah. What's going on? What's going on doing, folks? Oh, there's an email. All right, look at it. Ray out. Looks like it's cold still. Right. Hey, there's a a message for me. It must be from Damien. Check it out. Zoe, I hope you get this message. I had to leave quickly. The worm was. They found it, and they will track it back to me. I didn't want to leave you, but I had no choice. I tried to wake you up, but you, you weren't responding. The good I news know. is, before they caught it, the worm did collect enough data for me to get the coordinates we spoke about. Right. The intrusion into Dream Corps originated in Russia, just outside St. Petersburg. I've sent you the exact well, coordinates. Well, we're going to be drinking in Russia. If I manage to get out of here, that's where I'll be heading. All right. If you decide to go there, and I expect you will, be very careful. I'll try and contact you, but I can't promise anything. Zoe, okay. you must leave right now. When they discover who planted the worm, they'll send someone to the apartment. You need to be gone. The quickest way to St. Petersburg is by scramjet. Oh, and um, there's some warm clothes in the bathroom closet. Good luck. I'll, I'll see you soon, I hope. Take care of yourself. <laughs> All right, Burke, get gone then. from dad it's me i've been calling you for a couple of days now but you're not picking up and you haven't replied dad. to any of my messages what's going on where are you please call me as soon as you get this i'm getting worried tell okay. dad where you are oh. zoe why have you not left messages for him fuck's sake wait <laughs> you could just oh, uh. Uh, i'm sorry but i'm currently away from my phone Leave me a message and I'll call you back as soon as I can. Oh, for God's sake. Hey, Dad. Look, um, I'm sorry for not calling you back sooner. I'm... I've been so lazy. All I do is sleep and hang around the house. Big surprise, right? I hope things you... are going well for you. Why can't you just... Uh... You don't have to call me back, not unless uh... it's important. I'm perfectly fine. Very bored, but fine. 
<laughs> yeah. Oh, and don't worry. I haven't spoken to Reza. I'm staying out of trouble. Promise. Love you. What? Bye. Oh, you liar! You liar! Liars! Lies! Lies! I why lie? my time here sleep dressed like this. I think not. Damien Sorry. orders. I I don't think this has been cleaned in a while. Damien definitely needs a house bot. Alright, there's my one clothes. I look like a I look like a, a spy. Wait, let's get out of here. On the scramjet. Very reflective. Very stylish, film. Right, very, very stylish. That is a cool jet, though. Cruising along! When everyone died in the other rake realm, all I thought was good. That's one less, less loose head. <laughs> Here, we got rid of all the nonsense in there. It's a cool ship, though. Mr. Zulu, head will burn. Time in the power of Russia! Can you imagine some of the bombs going, Hey, hey, Russia, you bad bastards! Music as well. Aye. Okay. Hey, Zoe, so we're in Russia! These are the coordinates Damien gave me. If the data the worm got from the Dream Core is correct, the virus originated inside that factory building over there. Okay. There's no way to access this without the right card or data key. Can I hack it? I can't hack that. Uh, what about your screwdriver? No? Okay. There must be some way I can get in. Kick him in the nuts and I'll stop his god powers and then do a, a drop a rock on him. <laughs> Very Star Trek-ish thing to do, yes. Why does this... This car looks to be in working order. It might even have some power left. Which means <clears> that <throat> if I can access the controls, it can be moved. Oh, can we hack it? Oh. That's the car's access panel. Where? Where? I want to see the access panel. There it is. Uh, let's try the... Oh, for God's sake! Um, okay. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, God, Jesus. Alright, hang on a minute. Mm. That's right. Oh wait. Those two are right. Uh, okay. There we go. Fixed. This so now needs to be in working order. It might even have some power left. Oh, which can means I... that if I can act this car looks to be in working order. It might even have the systems are still operational, so the car must have some reserve power left. Right, so can I get this thing to move? This there car looks to be in working order. It might Yes. It might even have power left. Well, yes, we kind of know that. Oh, right, then I can hack it. Right, hack it. Hack it in time. Hack and slash. Yes! Okay, finally it does one. You could have done that ages ago. Oh, you feckin' pain in the ass. At least now it's in a position to help me get inside. 
Well, we got there, finally. Took long enough. Jesus. I hope I didn't damage it too badly. Oh, we At don't least care. now it's in a position to help me get inside. Yeah, good for you. Okay, so... No, no, Zoe, stop being a retard. Stop being a dunce. Like Kirsten Dunst. There it is. Uh, that's where I was wanting to go. Up we go! That took way longer than it should have. That was frustrating. I, I think it did that on purpose, just to piss me off there. Alright. Up we go! Right, up we go. Finally. We ascend! Whew! Look at all the pretty buildings. Whew. Get on there, there. Hey, everybody, we're on top of the mountains. Right. Right. I say this much, and I'm gonna do it right. I ain't fucking doing that shit again. Fucking suck that. Uh oh. <gasps> There's drones. There are drones. It loves to check crap out, doesn't it? Because I need to get to that fire escape, it seems. Which way is it gonna go? Can I come back? No. Nope. Go. Go, 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 Zoe, go. Go, Zoe. Go. Ding, 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 ding. That drone's just like, wow. I didn't see anything. If I hit it, maybe, maybe I can knock it out. Ooh. It's all about to fall. All it needs is a little... Encouragement. Whoops! Whoops! Oh, clumsy me! Ooh, shattering then. It's just. It's just going round again, isn't it? Zoe, you might want to get down a little bit faster. I'm gonna have to wait for it to come round, I think. I'm gonna have to wait for it to go round. <laughs> I kinda like how she's like... Just stay still. I'll actually go up a bit higher, just in case. You never know with those things. To guess. I have to guess. Guessing, guessing, guessing. To go around. I'm just gonna go around with it. Yeah. Don't give it a reason to come after me. Down we go. Infiltration style. Down the dun, dun, dun. Right. Lovely. Oh, I have a phone message. What the shit? Voicemail. New message. You have one new voice message from Dad. Um. Yeah. So I hope the swatter went well last night. Everything was okay in my room in the morning. Oh, yeah, no, I think I read that one. Where is it? Live. Help! Got you mess with you. I'm okay. No worries. I tracked down our friend's location and said, Oh, I know it's... Really? So... Right, no, it's... it's... The latest goes all the way down. Ah! You know vice versa from that. So... Alright, so that was Fitzy's name. I'm really sorry I had to leave you on your own, especially after promising I'd be there to wake up. I felt terrible. I didn't have a choice. You wouldn't wake up. I stayed there, they would have come and got me, and you too. I couldn't risk it, so make sure they... Ah, so I made sure they knew I left town. Hopefully I've been able to shake them. I'm afraid these people are very, very persistent. Take care, okay? Damien. So Damien, non-binary... 
disappeared. Sweetie, I had to get out of town and quick. I hope you didn't worry too much. I'm fine. I promise I'll have to remain I'll have to remain incommunicado for a while. I'll get in touch when things have cooled down. In the meantime, I plan on getting getting a lot of reading done. Good luck to you. They took the thing. Love from And that's from L. Right. Okay. Despite us causing property damage. Like we have to get out this way. At least I think so. Right. Well, they say. Hope I don't run into those twins again or anything. There's the stairs. Right. Oh, okay. The way we can get. And we're down. Good. Good on us. So, what do you think about this? Production line. It looks pretty old-fashioned. At least she's saying it's no. Is there an ancient post box here? That we can make it's the meme come back. Line. It looks pretty old. It's a production line. It looks it's pretty old-fashioned. Old -fashioned. Okay. This console must be for controlling the factory floor. Well, I couldn't think of anything else. That panel controls the loading bay doors. Right. It's a production line. I it know what our next meme's fashion. gonna be. It's a production line. Really, not this game too. Right. Turn on all the displays. Probably not the smartest idea, but I'll do it anyway. Crane. I don't like the music. The music's making me feel eerie. It's eerie. According to this, I'm standing exactly in the location where the intrusion originated. Okay. Or maybe right above it. I see a grey. This was put up quite recently. It looks brand new. Where did I see it? Which one was it? I, I know exactly what I've got to do. I know exactly what. I saw the grates. I saw the grates. It's a grate. I saw it. I think it was up to the. Ah, there it is. I see it. I see it. See if it's. I might have to go forward one more. Yeah, I'll have to go forward one more. Right. See this stuff. That's easy. I'm gonna try. No, it's too far. Okay. There. Need to. Oops. Into... And I've got a feeling I've got to attach it, don't I? If I just pull it up again, it's not going to click, is it? So, yeah, I think that's what I've got to do. Yeah. I thought that. I thought that. Because if I did, it would just go up and down, wouldn't it? I mean, what, to take the grape with it? It's a wee. Don't be silly, gal. Let's go. And I'm not moving it around. Whoop. Hey, got any crates? 
grates and all things that shake. I need to do a Batman thing. Batman with his cape and cowl. Batman with his cape and cowl. <laughs> this is definitely the da 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 Ooh, let's exit. I'm getting goosebumps looking at that. Yep, yep, we we get that. Thanks. It's locked. Locked, is it? Locked. Lockers. Lockers. Is any of them open? No? Oh. No. Oh. No. Can't lock. Okay. Okay. It looks to oh. be in working order. Ooh. Technology down here that works. How convenient. It's a bedroom. Oh! There's a. So there is! It's a broken one. What's this? What's in here? in there? A key? It's a key! To open the locker. I think it does. Yeah, it does. No brainer. Okay, what's inside it's it? It's an access card. I don't like the music. I really don't like the music. It looks to be in working order. I turn it on? It looks to be in working order. It's a bedroom filled with medical equipment. They must have been observing the patient from out here. Right. Oh, I don't like this. Is this like going to be some sort of really bad experiment here? Really bad feeling about this. It's the dollhouse! It's the fucking dollhouse! There's something in here. Is that a data cube? Yes, take the data cube. It's a dollhouse. Oh, and it's a fake snowy landscape. Aha! One bed, one patient, a child. Who was it? What were they doing here? A child's drawings. Oh, I'm getting so much goosebumps for this room. I don't like this. It's like the exorcist crap. They had crap. this patient under constant observation. But for what reason? I mean, wouldn't it be a bit annoying that it's all fake? Like, all of it's fake. A child's drawings. Anything else of noteworthiness? That doll's house looks... Yeah, well, let's get out of here. See if that, what that date cube will tell us for our story. In it goes. Wednesday, right. September 23rd. This is Dr. Park. Dr. Zuboff is currently with the subject in her room. The subject is improving after a prolonged illness. She's responding well to stimuli, and appears to be in good spirits. Hooray! She, uh, she even smiled at me when I went in there this afternoon to give her the injection. She didn't say much, but Faith's always been a quiet girl. We're having problems with the new synth, mm. however, and yesterday's Morpheus injection caused the subject some degree of discomfort and pain. Off the okay. record, I have to admit that I've had some misgivings about it's putting her. someone through these experiments. So Faith is her name. Granted, Jiva created her for this purpose, and it's not like she's ever had a normal life, but still. Hmm. At any rate, it's not like we have a choice. We're simply following orders, and what is what he he uh... that we keep pushing forward. So this will all be leading up to, to the wire and what's going on the stack. Yeah. Down. There's all tying up. Faith, the subject, would have to be terminated. What? Just because they finished the project, so she can't live a normal life after the experiment. October 9th, it's a, a Friday, I think. 
I haven't seen daylight in a week. Faith has... The subject has fallen ill again. We haven't isolated the cause of this latest setback, but Faith's heart appears to be, uh, to be weakening. I don't know if it's her condition or if the drugs... Anyway, oh, she really needs to be in a proper medical facility, but unfortunately that does not appear to be an option. HQ doesn't want the subject to be moved. So they're condemning I, her to death. I really Jesus. Wish there was something I could do. The the subject. Hmm. I just hope she doesn't have to die here. Faith is well, she's just a child. And I feel responsible. Partly responsible. Medical Obviously, ethics here, people? Jobs, Medical ethics? Still, what the hell? I'm going home now. Dr. Grundal is taking over my next shift. I need to... to rest. To sleep. I haven't slept in... anyway. Mm. That October. is crazy, though. What is it? October? Oh, what? November 3rd? God. The... the subject is very ill. We just gave her a very large injection of the new Morpheus, as per HQ's mm. brief, but she's not responding. There's something seriously wrong. I think the dosage... Well, I don't... Uh, I don't think she'll last... Wait. Jesus. Wait, something... Something's happening here. I'm getting some really strange... Hey, hey, uh. has your console stopped working? This is... This is weird. Uh, there's just static, like, like a. a oh. I'm just getting static so here. So that moment when What's she. What's going on? Broke. Okay. 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 Oh, okay. We're back now. We're. Okay, maybe we're good. Not. Well, that was weird. For a second, I thought I saw. Shit! Oh shit! I think we. I think we just. Oh, lost okay. Her. Maybe we just it was. Lost her. I'm not getting any any readings here. She's flatlined. I think she's dead. Faith's dead. The dosage. I think we, we. I think she's. And dead. she will deed. She went into the wire. Oh Can shit! You please, just please, please go check on her. I think she. She's dead now. I think she just passed away. Go. <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, take your time, old man. Take your time. That's it. Shit. November fifth. We're, uh, we're cleaning out the lab. We can't leave anything behind, or someone might. It's strange, but I... I watched her die. I saw her leave us. But I think... I think something happened. I'm not sure what happened, but something did happen. First, there was this static everywhere on our screens. It killed most of the equipment for, like, 15 seconds. And then, I could swear I saw something. Like from the ring there, like just that. Just kind of thing, yeah. Fleeting moment. Ah, uh, that's how the. Um, a, a shadow. Maybe a she house. was a dreamer. A dreamer, Faith's you know. House, her dollhouse. That's why it's. I don't why it's plan there. on saying anything to anyone about the experiments, about the lab, about what happened. But I am leaving this crystal behind. I won't let them simply wash their hands of her like she was never here like she never oh, but existed. late for your ethical uh system she there better than that she deserves to be remembered she was a person a girl tell everyone then but clearly you didn't her name was faith jesus this is dr janine park yeah janine park where's your freaking yeah your ethic went out the window jesus fool that's ridiculous. Yeah, we, we, we see that. I use the card to get out then. No, that is... That is intense. That was very, very not good. This door leads out to the factory floor, but it's closed and there's no handle. I think it's time for us to leave. 
Yeah. I don't think there's anything else for us here now. That panel controls the loading bay doors. Damn. That takes us outside, okay. I should be able to climb up there now. I should be able to climb up there now. Guess I can leave. <laughs> yeah, let's get out of here. Reversal. Okay. Are we? Oh wait, 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 wait. No. No. I... Okay. I think we are just at the very end. I don't know her. <laughs> hey. Another, another kid running around like an idiot again. No. It's an ancient post box. <laughs> we missed it for the first time. It's an ancient post box. <laughs> we can bring that meme back now. At the end of the game, we came and came all around the world to find the ancient post box. Oh. Chardin de Rose. Chardin de Rose. Help plants. I guess I just brushed through your mind. So what about Damien? What about him? Oh. Dad? My god, Zoe. You have not been an easy person to get hold of. Where have you been? Where have you been? Home. Casablanca. Around. Sorry, uh, I didn't think you'd be so worried. Worried? Well, that's an understatement. You don't have to lie anymore. I know you haven't been home. What do you mean? Of course I've been. After our last conversation, I logged into the house and spoke with Wonkers. He told me you haven't been home for at least a week. Dad. Wonkers, we thought you were cool! What I don't get is why you had to lie to but me. But I didn't know why. Dad, you just told them. I had to go away for a little while. So where have you been? I'm not doing this over the phone. I'm home again now. Ask Wonkers if you want to. Hell, check the cameras if you don't believe me. I don't know what to believe. Was it Reza? Yes. No. I had to help him. But that wasn't the only thing that... I don't yeah. think we should talk about this over the phone. When are you coming back? I'm still stuck out here. Oh. The day, very least. Look, I'm sorry for lying to you, but I have my reasons. I didn't want you to worry. Well, that backfired. I know. Yeah. But you don't have to worry about me anymore. I'm back and I'm staying put. I'll tell you everything when you get home, okay? Okay. I'll try to speed things up at my end, but... It... No. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Just come home when you can. Take care, Zoe. I'll call you tomorrow. And try to stay out of trouble. Yeah. Bye, Dad. Well, well I hope so. But then... But nothing hurts now. That like, what about... Damien? He's kind of went like, poof, he disappeared. No doubt this will all kind of copyright the nonsense for this. There's Wonkers like Traitor! Traitor Wonkers! We liked you! We liked you, but no, no. Is this when she has her crying moment? Yeah, no. <laughs> it's an epic NPC man, if anyone doesn't know what I'm on about. Oh! 
Or you just lie on it like a. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, because they're gonna monetize that guy. Like, yeah, no, Hello, it's copyright. Zoe. It's good. To Hello, Zoe. Are you crying? Hey. I'm betrayed by you. No, no, I'm, I'm just. Yeah, I'm crying. <laughs> I see. Why? Because you betrayed me. Because I'm sad. <laughs> I'm, I'm definitely <laughs> staying. Good. That makes me happy. I like it when you're here. By the way, you have a visitor, Zoe. Uh, visitor? Yes. Wait, what? She asked me questions. What kind of questions? The difficult kind. The kind I can't answer. About you and about your father. Where is she now? She's out there. She wanted to see the view. I told her she should wait for you, but she didn't listen to me. Who is she? Hello, Zoe. Oh! What are you doing here? How did you get in? I came to talk to you. You've been on a very long journey. I'm glad you finally made it back. How did... You. I've traveled around the world, but it all comes back to you. Faith, mm -hmm. she was your experiment. Jeeva's experiment. She is. I mean... She was. But we weren't the ones who made her into what she is today. That was Watikorp. That was Pete's. Pete, I wanted Pete to live out her life in peace with a foster family. She didn't have long. And she'd been through enough already. But Watikorp had. Your other unethical plans. nonsense, they you! a suitable human subject for testing their drug Morpheus with DreamNet. So they took Faith away. And you went with that! You I went know. with it! They put her through hell. Yeah. I never wanted that. You don't get to make excuses. She was your creation. She was your responsibility. Fair preach, enough. Zoe. Preach. Looking back, I realize it was a mistake to let them take her. But Wadi Corp owns us. We don't get to have a say. You're not telling me anything I don't know. <laughs> Why are you here? Yeah, pretty much, Did yeah. bring the eye with you, the twins. Uh? Go ahead, do your worst. I'm too tired to care anymore. I'm here to ask for your help. My... Uh, really? Help? What? What do you mean? Yeah, okay. I want to stop Watikorp from releasing the Dreamer. <sighs> and I want to stop the static from spreading any further. You may consider me cruel and... Bye unfair, bye glasses. But I'm simply pragmatic. There's nothing to be gained from Wadi succeeding with their plans, or the static causing another collapse. And uh? I also have personal reasons for wanting to stop Pete's. He has already caused much pain, and he will cause untold damage if his plans are carried out. What makes you think yeah. I'll help you with anything? I'm not yeah, expecting cause... you to help me, but you will help Faith. You won't let her suffer anymore. And you will stop Watikorp, even if they hadn't killed your friend. How do you know all this? Yeah, I you did a bug on you when we first met, Zoe. Oh. Uh... data at regular intervals. You I've heard everything lie? You I know everything that's happened. I've helped you along the way, and now you will help me because that's the only way you can help Faith. The only way you can avenge Reza and stop Watikorp. It's as simple as that. How Jesus. can I help I've... Faith? She's already dead, isn't she? Yes, and mm. no. I can't explain it, but you've seen it for yourself, Zoe. She's in the networks, in DreamNet, on the wire. Whether it's her, her memories, her soul, soul. I don't know. Yes, soul. It's not for me to theorize. The fact is that a part of her is inside the networks, inside Dream Core, and she's suffering. But you can help her, Zoe. If I do this, I won't stop with Watty or with Pete. You need to be held accountable too. Hell oh, yeah, woman. The moment the eye finds me, I'm dead. Wadi doesn't want me walking around telling people what I know. If that's not accountability, well. I don't know what it is. <laughs> and right now, all I want is revenge for what they've done to me and my company. Not your company. Everything, 
so be it. So what is it you want me to do? You need to go into DreamNet and convince Faith to let go. Once that happens, the network will shut down, and Angana, DreamCore, will disconnect from the wire. Convince Faith to... How do I do that? And why me? Because you have a connection with her. I don't know what it is. You seem to share some of her more esoteric genetic qualities. <laughs> esoteric. And she's taken a shine to you. Besides, <laughs> no one else has been able to find out where in the network Faith or her residue, her memories, reside. I've tried, but it's like she's not actually in there. You, on the other hand, have met her several times. She's reaching out to you. She needs you. So there must be some... I mean... And to help her. Cause like I said, it's been so long since I played this game. Years and years and years and years ago. And I don't remember this. Talk to Faith. Find a way to make her let go. Whatever she's become... Let go. A virus, Just a let it go. In the machine, only she can stop this. If she keeps holding okay. on. If her influence keeps spreading across the wire, it will eventually shut down completely. We're talking days. Maybe less than that. If she can do that, what is she? I don't She's know. part of the Matrix. Like I said, a ghost in the machine. Her body is gone, but her mind. They pumped her full of Morpheus. They murdered her with an overdose. Who knows? Maybe there is something as banal as an immortal soul. And that's what's left of her. She died while she was inside DreamNet, dreaming a very, very powerful dream. Maybe she's still in that dream, and that's what's Ergo, the, the house. Fire. Ergo. Whatever the answer. Okay. It doesn't matter. So the as I was saying, she's a dreamer then. There somehow, inside DreamNet, inside Angana. And she needs to leave. Get You're out. She no. needs to die. She's already no. dead, Zoe. That's a fact. That's but cold. But her isn't happy in there. She needs to shut down. Move on. Whatever you want to call it. And you expect me to ask her to let go? To die? Yes, because it's the right thing to do. Listen to me. We're running out of time. So I there got the Star Wars Major with Ghost in the Shell in this game. What's next? Blade Runner, Chop Gun. I'm going to be surprised. surprised. Again. If that happens, the wire will break down, causing untold damage. Snip! Wattie Corp may still succeed in releasing the Dreamer, and Pete's plans could still come to fruition. I actually think, every time everyone. I hear that, I just think of the Disney yeah. Pete, you know, the... Like, I think you're despicable. Yes, you, you are despicable! Test subject. You made her, and then you discarded her. And for what? To research dreams? <laughs> Still, I won't let the bad guys win. I've come this far. And this I'm sounds like manipulation. Away. It really does sound I'm like manipulating. Not long ago that I lack commitment. Well, connect me to the dreamer. Oh no! And as we know, to give you a I think. Concentrated dose of oh, and this is what, what you've received has put her in the fucking bed, isn't it? If I remember, that's probably what it is. Allow you to control your environment. That way, faith will be able to push you out again. What do I tell okay. her? How do I make her let go? I don't know. You have to figure that out on your own. This is unknown territory. Are you ready? I would have agreed to this, but... Good luck. And so nice creepy. Time. Pop! It's like, now you're dreaming, now you're going to sleep, now you're dreaming, now you're asleep, now you're dreaming, now you're asleep. Shit gets real. Faith wants me to come inside. I am not gonna dictate that with a response. So the longest journey. Ah our title. The game. Is it? No, stop it. I recognize that house. It's the one from my visions. Crunch, 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 crunchy, crunch, 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 crunch. 
Oh, the music is so eerie. I don't like that. So we're actually getting to see inside the house now. Uh, yeah. I just want to say, Faith, you've got a very messed up dream. Oh, and it curls as well. What the f and she's there. Oh. But then again, like, how long has she been in this dream net? Can it? Well, been in there. She wondered, didn't Hello? it? Hello? 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 She is. Hi. You must be Faith. I'm Zoe. She already Hello. knows that. Yeah, what are you doing? The die. Um, I see. What are you playing? A game. Really? Would you like Can to I play, play a game? Maybe. <laughs> okay. You've been helping me, haven't you, Faith? The white lady told me to. The white oh. dragon. What did the white lady say? She said to talk to you. Did she tell you that I had to save April Ryan? Yes. Well, she doesn't look so scary what now. What does the white lady look like? Oh, She's maybe not. White. When did oh. you last see her? She was here, just before you. She was? Yes. What did she say? She said it's all fine. She said you did good. She said you saved April. That's what she said? That I saved April? By killing April? Yes. That You doesn't... know I've been looking oh. for you, don't you? Yes. Why me? Why did you talk to me, Faith? Because you're like me. Like you? A dreamer. How? You dream like me. You mean, dream things true? Yes. You're my sister. I'm... What? what? Your sister? Yes. You're my big sister. You mean because of the way we dream? No, what? because we're sisters. For real. What? Faith, this is very what? important. What makes you think we're sisters? I just know. Dad? The white lady says so too. We have the same mother. We do. Faith, I'm sorry. But that's not possible. My mother died long before you were born. Mm -mm. Smells like a lie. No. Our mother isn't dead. And we are sisters. That's... That's impossible. It's true. I know. I'm not lying. I believe you, Faith. Okay? I, I do believe you. It's just... I thought my mother was dead. Dies. Do you remember your mother? No, I don't know. And I don't want to talk about that. Let's talk about something else. Like what? The day to day current events? Why are you here? <laughs> because I don't have anywhere else to go. You can't stay here. You're hurting the world. I know. That's what the white lady said. But I don't know where to go. And She's terrified. She's and, scared. And I'm scared, Zoe. There you go, I know. yeah. I would be too. But sometimes we have to let go. Sometimes we just have to trust that things will be okay. Sometimes we just have to have faith. Faith, you're not supposed to be here anymore. <laughs> you're supposed to be to be gone. I'm supposed to be dead. No, oh, you're not. Uh... Yes. Yes, Faith. You're supposed to be dead. Heavy. I know, but I don't want to go. I'll be alone. Maybe. Maybe not. I can't promise you anything. But I believe there's something better waiting for you. And I the irony. Da, I can da, promise da. you that I'll stay here as yeah. long as you need me to. You'll stay with me? I will. You won't have to be alone anymore. Okay. Okay. So she just wanted someone to be with her before she went. That's quite intense, that. It is quite intense, isn't it? She's just playing. She's not really... But I suppose she hasn't got much else room to do anything, so that makes sense. I 
And like just Zoe's like, yeah, I'm just chilling. My legs are getting numb though. <laughs> So, just gonna play it like, man. Have a gap there over the step in it. I'm getting sleepy, Zoe. It's okay, sweetie. You can go to sleep. I'm getting cold too. Come here. Yes. Will you stay with me? As long as you need me to, Faith. Even when I'm sleeping? Even when you're sleeping. I promise. Okay. Good night, Zoe. Good night, big sister. Good night, little sister. I won't get goosebumps. Oh, that's intense. It's heavy. Whoa! And that's... That's her gone. Goodbye, Faith. Gone. There you go. That's it kind of enveloping itself then to end that dream because she was faith was the creator of that dream realm. I'm guessing, yeah. Great piano work, bro. Oh, it's the white core. It's the fat. Oh, this is the weird guy with the. No, 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 I don't like this guy. He's creepy. He's like the Robotnik when he's like, I'm having a bath. So, is that you? Oh, you must help me. There's only darkness. He stole my eyes, my ears. He took the world away from me. There's nothing left. Nothing. Do you hear me? Are you there? I need my senses back. Answer me! Answer me! Oh, you pets? <laughs> Papa can't oh. hear you. And he can't talk to you. Oh, pets? Pets? pets. What are you? You're gonna kill you. <laughs> Stabbed to death. Oh, so she's gonna be the new in charge of Wattie Corp. I'm sorry about this, Zoe, but I can't let you wake up again. So, yeah, as predicted, it was her that. Bye. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. You really are a very beautiful girl. So, like your father. I never thought I'd see you again. I had my suspicion there, but it says. I think I had that suspicion that. And I wish it didn't have to end like this. So you, you killed your first daughter, and now you're killing your second doctor. You have no medical ethics! You don't have any ethics! You're a terrible person! Is she asleep? She is. I'll stay here and watch over her. I hope she got shot afterwards. You should. You Maybe should. when she wakes up, she'll want to play a game with me. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe she'll want to kill you. I would like that very much. Oh, Wonkers, you're so ob oblivious. Oh, Wonkers. Oh, no. And then we're back to the very start of where we were. Dreamfall! My story. 
Ah, oh, man. It sounds pretty Oof. unbelievable, I know. Parts of it still feel like a dream. Poppycock, it sounds like. <laughs> but it did happen. All of it. I helped send Faith on her way. The static is gone. Things are back to normal. All should be well with the world. Except it's not. At all. The bad guys got away with it. The dreamer could still be released. If that happens... We're all screwed. I'm not sure how long I've been here, or how long I'm going to stay. But there's nothing more I can do now. My story's been told. The future is out of my hands. And in yours. You need to do something. Me? You need to tell my story until the word is out. Until everyone knows what's going on. Hear ye, hear ye! Here's the story! Freefall, the longest journey! I'm leaving soon. Pull up a chair. I'm not afraid. Sorry. If death is the end, I know that our dreams remain behind. So whoever you are, whatever you plan to do, good luck. I'm sure you'll need it. I hope my story has been heard. I feel really stupid if I find out I've been talking to myself this whole time. <laughs> I'll just walk out of the room and pretend I... Reza. Oh, Reza's! So Reza wasn't dead, so it... Thank God. They were lying. Oh, man. She... She's fading away. Wake up! I need to get myself awake. Careful, Dad. That is not him. Wait, what? What do you mean by that? Goodbye. Unless they've mastered cloning. What happens if it... Mmm. But then, like it says, probably knew it could have been... Oh, we're back at the... The, 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 the undreaming, the dreaming. Oh, yeah. There's that guy again! Welcome to the story time. Story story. time. Oh, he makes my E. It's quite cool. Hello. I like this guy. Am I dead? I don't know. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I did not know. This is where everything is. Here, you simply are. Alive or dead, you just are. Understand? Basically, don't ask those kind of questions. You're special. I am. You are a dreamer. Someone else told me that. Is that good? It is. And it isn't. Oh, for There's sake. nothing good or bad about it. Like the stars above and the stones below. It simply is. Oh. So, where are we again? In the story time. This is where the story are told the stories well, the, the sky and the ground and all that is in between you see zoe this universe and everything in it is like an endlessly thick book containing countless stories that's hmm. amazing can you tell me one of those stories i could but not now there's no What's happening? Why do we have to act? Because the undreaming is unchained. I don't know what that means, but it doesn't sound good. Hmm. So where do I begin? At the beginning, Zoe. At the beginning? It's going to be a long story. That's fine. Okay. My name is Zoe Castillo, and I think I might be dead, but I'm not sure. My father's name is... So is she going to tell him the entire story? It all began when... And he's like, Ooh, I'm ready. I mean, I need some visual aid. <laughs> or is this, like, she telling him a brand new story? Could be. And finally, 
Pretty mums later. Today is the day everyone's been waiting for. Isn't that right, Ryan? <laughs> Ryan! <laughs> That's right, Diane. It's been a closely guarded secret for months. But today, Wattycore finally unveils its hotly and Oh no. They released it. Dream time. Fans have been lining up in front of stores for weeks in preparation for what some are calling the single greatest event in recorded history. Wow. If you didn't have to be here this morning, Ryan, I'm sure you'd be out there lining up with the rest of them. <laughs> you betcha, Diane. Watikor <laughs> has yet to reveal what Dreamtime is all about, except that it's destined to change the face of entertainment forever. Why are rumors happy hmm. that Dreamtime will allow people to dream lucid dreams about anything they want? So Ooh, then... Something mm. like Modern technology. <laughs> oh, you gotta love it. You just gotta love it, Diane. <laughs> but then if you're stuck in dreams, what would happen to the world eventually? There's your tower. Kinda makes me wonder if this is why this tower was built by it's actually them guys doing that stuff. And now there's no April to stop it. And Fla that was Greenfall. Finally got through it. Finally battled through it. Alright. Don't know if I can press again to skip because we'll get us back to the main menu now. And that's us battle through it. We went through the entire story. Took us a while, but we got there in the end. I'll put my glasses back on now so I can see if there's anything else coming our way. But there we have it. We actually had that. That was quite. It's as good as I remember. I honestly found that as good as I remember. It, it's, it had a lot of story behind it. I mean, during our adventures, we had a few kind of issues, but I'm too strenuous, which is good. But I know what you guys thought about the whole story in general. I mean, if you were here for the entire start through, you can catch up with it um, on future stuff via the YouTube channel just to kind of keep up for the playthrough of the entire thing. But it was a hell of a venture. We had some weird stuff happening. I actually enjoyed it. I mean, coming back to it after when it first released to playing it now and noticing little details and a little bit more. How people's opinion change when you first play it. You don't think anything. Um... I actually didn't think the graphics were too bad. It didn't really bother me per se. The sequel, the the Dreamfall chapters, I've gotten a hold of it, and it's supposed to be a little bit more graphically better. But in truth, I really think it was okay. I didn't think there was too much problems with the graphics. Some of the voice acting could have been a bit better to dictate. Like Zoe could have been a bit more personality in her sometimes. She felt a little bit bland sometimes. Um, but I guess it was the audio acting, the voice acting at the time, and everything like that. It's a hit and miss kind of thing, isn't it? But I will, um, pull on to Dreamfall chapters in the future. I really will be picking that up and actually going through that scenario too. I think it's really worth actually investigating and actually really getting my hands dirty in because... There's a lot more going on in Dreamfall chapters that I know of. Um, at the moment, I see that my sister is streaming just now. Um, what I am going to do is throw it via that way. So that is us done for the day. Because I did a quite a good three hours of that. And that has tied up everything in a nice pretty big bar this one so i can uninstall it now and kind of move on to dreamful chapters if we do that might not be for another good few weeks or so before i do that 
but we will continue with other games in the meantime. I mean, I know I've got the Telltale series Back to the Future to finish up to redo the last episode of that. It will be taking up. That will be coming back possibly during this week. Get that out of the way so I've got all of them and complete that playthrough because the playthrough I did do was accidentally deleted by accident and made a bit of a carbuncle with that. But that say, being said, this is Blue Streaks Better Fire Force saying, I'll swing it guys later. Thank you for being here with me and enjoying my stream. And hopefully um, we will catch up for the next one. Maybe later on tonight as well, I'll be doing another one. I'll be putting you on to Miss Riddick's stream, so thank you for being here. Bye!